as we are once again alive upon the internet. <laughs> and the Kerfers uh, taking first place there right away, uh, not giving anybody a chance. <laughs> Hello there. As, uh, running in, and so did I as well. Um, yeah, I'm gonna jump on in. Gonna do some farming, some looting, some shooting, some tooting. And uh, hey there, Muddy and Pomic as well. As, uh... as yeah, actually, I did get a chance to play a little bit earlier. Uh, went and farmed a little bit for LMGs, but didn't get what I was after. Uh, Yuzina isn't anywhere good today. It's on one of the New York missions, uh, not one of the good ones. Yeah, for today, I'm hoping to just uh, run around and shoot some stuff. <laughs> Did I actually do a bunch of levels, turns out. Um, ah, uh, had a normal behavior in Countdown. <laughs> just uh, weird people doing weird shit, uh, most likely then, I'm going to guess. Uh... It's weird again, change quality in your stream. Um, hmm. Actually, yeah, not something I ever messed with. Oh, yeah, indeed. Um, hmm. Wonder why that is. Maybe, maybe the stream has to be running for a little bit before it like catches up and stuff. Or maybe, like, there's too many streamers. <laughs> And uh, they don't have enough capacity and are just being lazy and not down rendering anything. Okay, so yeah, I'm gonna guess from that that it's usually available and now isn't. <laughs> Weird. Uh, on my end, I don't believe I've done anything different. So, and also, I don't believe I even have any options towards those kinds of things. So, hopefully, it'll uh, fix itself up. Uh, in a little bit. I'll refresh my stream view and try as well. Uh, let's see. Nope. <laughs> I have a... Uh... Yeah, uh, for me, after a refresh, it wasn't there either. So, you're not the only one, Pama. No, I'm, I'm curious to maybe... Maybe... Uh, uh, could be issues, could be by design uh, of uh, I'm trying to limit <laughs> loads. Um, a prime only thing. Hmm. Uh, that could also be. That would be weird though. <laughs> like, yeah, changing quality is kind of something that yeah some people require. Um, I'm going to go do a descent run. Uh, I don't know if anybody's interested in uh, maybe joining me for one, uh, as uh, this character still has to uh, get his weekly project in. Uh, so I'm going to be going and doing that. And yeah, some company along the way is never uh, it's never a bad thing, I feel. As uh, Pomix in, as he says there. Uh, yeah, feel free to just uh, join up on me. I did just to start off, we'll go do a descent. I think later on I might, uh, if there's uh, any interest. Uh, uh, Another agent has joined your group. Uh, let's do some countdowns or something like that, just uh, farming a bit. Oh, there's a Geo Guesser in Division 2. <laughs> that is, uh, I didn't even. I didn't even knew that. Knew that. Ah, 
Oh, in one of the discords, right? <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah. Find the spot and recreate the deck. Ah, okay. Yeah, that can be uh, can be fun. I, I still want to kind of do as well. Uh, uh, going around through basically all of the mission and taking uh, pictures of all of the loot spots and trying to do it all in kind of like the same way so that the chest is kind of always in the same spot. And then uh, trying to go like... Uh, making a quiz out of it of uh, of where it is. Okay. Well. Uh, okay. Yeah. Feel uh, whenever you're ready, uh, hop on board. And yeah, if anybody else is interested, feel free to. Uh, Either say so, and I'll get you on my list and uh, invite you, or uh, or if you are on my list, then, uh, then uh, feel free to hop on. <laughs> well, that wouldn't help that much with just like all of the loot positions, because like, if you don't know them, you don't know them. But it would be a cool, like I think, uh, um, uh, just challenge thing. Uh, I'm gonna guess we're with present party. I'll uh, I'll just start us uh, heading off. As I catch a big sneeze as uh, as the dust being shuffled around by my fan got to me there. But yeah, one of the things I will be doing is uh, when I do um, the third account run Safe area detected. Uh, I'll be doing all of the all of the spots that have. Uh, Shade tech prohibited. I'll be getting basically all of the loots in all of the missions and just talking about it and also showing all of the like secrets in missions. Um, although I yeah, I don't know how to like I don't know if that will ever like make it into its own contents. Was it because it already exists? Uh, there was there is already a bunch of like old videos from other people. Uh, that have uh, that have like all of the loot positions, permissions, and all the secrets and stuff. As I grab the demolisher, just to have something there already. I don't mind the demolisher; it's not the worst choice. Uh, Okay. Yeah, I mean, you could actually do even like real geo. Uh, let's do this other one, which has a red. Um, Room selected. Difficulty rating easy. But yeah, actually, yeah, you could kind of even like do GeoGuessr and just set it to DC, <laughs> uh, like the area. Initiated. But yeah, I just want to do basically a lot of a lot of the chests, even even some of the open world ones. Although uh, the open world chests for for that idea, uh, a lot of them wouldn't work because there's a lot of positions that just nobody ever really goes. Like I, I could put positions in there that I would even like <laughs> never guess. <laughs> like it would be too hard to like kind of guess because with the other ones you could at least go like okay, it's it's like this mission and that would be enough to kind of. Kind of go by. Mm. And some yellow and black uh, drops in. Oh, no, yellow and black. Oh, you mean the, the parachute ones? Well, all of those are also actually available from. Uh, uh, Easy. Wait, what weapon did I have selected there that showed no ammo? <laughs> For a second there, I was on a weapon that was empty, empty. Well, I don't have any of this. Construction. Um, but yeah, those are all... Uh, um, there's like the Division 2 map, which has like an interactive map kind of thing. Uh, that one already has like all of those positions as well. Because yeah, I don't think I 
I either know like all of those still. I used to because in, back in the day in year one, that's that was one of the better ways to get gear mods and stuff because those were actually like hard to get. Uh, gear, oh, well, no, uh, skill mods especially. Now adrenaline rush as my free talent. But yeah, through the years, I've forgotten most of it. Because yeah, we would do a run which would hit all of the yellow ones in DC. Uh, but yeah, that's 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 long ago at this point. <laughs> I still know some of them that I that like are on the ways to like CPs and stuff. And yeah, let's stick to uh, all easies or as much as possible. Room selected. Easy. Mm. I'll take this downstairs one. Hostiles constructing. Hostiles spawn from highlighted doors. No idea what happened there to my demolisher. <laughs> Just targeted some stuff and then didn't want to actually go deal with it. Uh, surprise me when you found some caches in open world you don't know. Last month I don't win. <laughs> well, I mean, the open world ones are... are there's a lot of them that are just are uh, in, in like weird positions that you just don't ever go. And also, of course, the open world ones don't scale. So there's no like value to knowing them and remembering them. Now uh, let's take the one with the yellows. Yellows are more useful. Might get trauma. Entering new room. Difficulty rating. But yeah, there's a lot of like open world ones that I would I would say that like I would know a lot of them. <laughs> but just going off of a picture, I wouldn't be able to tell you like this is this one over here, just because there's so many. There's like so, so many. And a lot of places will look alike. Um, like a chest in front of a garage door is going <laughs> to look the same as another chest. <laughs> another dozen chests that are also all in that same way. I'm also still always surprised as I, as I saw it come back up again in, in like a Reddit discussion or something that people were going like that it's that they wanted a world chest to scale. And I've heard that so many times nowadays, but I, I to me it always is just like But then like that would ruin the entire game <laughs> to me. <laughs> like that that is like the same Thinking that people go in with like, oh no, let's leave overpowered power stuff in because oh, why? Because it's, it doesn't matter because it's a PVE game or something like the, that kind of reasoning that sometimes people use. Vital science. Uh, this name is just gonna walk up on me. I'm hoping I can. Okay, it's nice of him to stop there. I don't have a health gate, so I better just. <laughs> uh, Let's just finish him <laughs> before he, because yeah, he has the ability to kill all three of us quite easily. It's, uh... Yeah, let's see what we get as our uh, as our exotic. Uh, no plate for me out of these three. I will pick uh, incessant. None of the three will be active during <laughs> Nemesis fight, really. Because uh, during Nemesis, I'll lose my Incessant after the first mag and then not have it. Yeah, Pomic didn't get played either.
Faith empty seven. A red and a med kit slot. Yeah, let's just stick to the easies. Uh, well, uh, get some. Uh, Enter new location. Yeah, that's kind of what they're for. That they're mostly there for leveling and. and We'll have three doors here, so we'll each take one. It's only one wave, so it's pretty easy. Also, like, if they were to scale uh, to heroic, then why would you ever... Like, if they drop the same loot as drops, <laughs> then it would all become about just going and find, like... Maps of, of all of those drops would just be super important, and then you would just go around and 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 just get get the drops, <laughs> and then just swap characters and do it again. Uh, why farm when you can do it so much easier? Or why do combat when you can do it so much easier? Like them changing it in missions because in missions there it used to also be that they didn't scale. Uh, changing those. Uh, I'm like perfectly fine with it because you have to fight your way in anyway to uh, get access to them. Hostiles constructing. Hostiles spawn from highlighted doors. Although of course, yeah, there's a few chests that are before uh, any point of uh, of combat, but like one or two doesn't matter. <laughs> Mm. I'm some project like open hundred get an example. Oh. <laughs> well, let's take the medium here just for that extra bit. Doing a medium and an easy there isn't much difference. We'll still be ahead. Entering new location. Difficulty rating. Medium. Well, the thing is, they, they already do give resources and stuff, just by deconstruction. Constructing uh, combatant. Did I get steady handed or something? Oh, yeah. <laughs> Wondering why I got to fire as long as I did there, but yeah, I did have, uh, I did have. Mm, sure, obliterate. Enter new location. Difficulty rating easy. No, mostly I think it's just those open world chests are fine. They're just sometimes they're worth still opening. Sometimes you still, I mean, low chance of high gear uh, doesn't mean doesn't mean no <laughs> chance of high gear. Uh, I've gotten plenty of like items out of those that uh, I found uh, use. Uh, Yeah, I shouldn't re-roll, I should hang on to these credits. And just so I have enough uh, for another slot. Because I'm already full up on reds. <laughs> and need as well for her. For purple build players like me, although actually the, the chests aren't really great for purple builds because uh, hard enemies, like hard scaling is actually, like works the best by such a large margin that it's, 
Although it's still sometimes from time to time I've yeah, even gotten purple gear out of those that I've used. Yes. Yeah. I think. Uh, I was about to say I think recently we actually even got a weapon out of there, but uh, no, actually no. I think that dropped from doing a CP on like normal or something. While well, I was just getting some memento stacks. Mm. Yeah, I'm gonna stick to my red bluing. Red blue, red blue, red blue. Charge of sound for electricity. Mm, I should spend these. Get that already. <laughs> Not where I wanted to go, but oh, I'm sixty definitely. Yeah, I'm sixty. And yeah, I have uh, two more loops to get a skill. So. That will likely uh, still happen. Is it? The burst, the demolisher that I have will turn into a blinder, which is which is still fine. Blinders are annoying, but they're not. They're not instant death. Hostile construction initiated. See, I don't know which faction we're fighting. It is our good old friends, the Outcast. How did that not? Serious trauma detected. Console online. It's like half a mag in his uh, in his backpack. Didn't didn't want to ignite. <laughs> didn't want to cook off. Uh, does anybody have Overwatch yet? Because I have the option to now. I don't think I've seen it on the buff bar yet. Okay. Right. Then uh, I'll take Overwatch. I have Composure already anyway as well, so... Those two fit together well. Try to get a few ranks on it. All the smiley faces. New room. Difficulty rating. Medium. Hostile construction initiated. I don't think the far one here. Rank right away. I should have came that way. Going that way. Mm, that's. Well, let's take the easy. Especially as it has one more red anyway. Mm. We'll take this one. Constructing hostile combatant. Uh, <laughs> so I accidentally got out of cover and reset uh, Overwatch. Console active. Yeah, incessant chatter. I haven't even like. Hit it once. Oh, I have trauma as well now. That's good. Mm. 
Ja, was ist der Kerl? Poison Gas Hazard. Activated. I'm kind of looking forward especially to Descent in the new season. Easy. I'll take this. Uh, Hostiles okay. constructing. Hostiles spawn from the changes seem pretty, pretty good. Uh, the dilution of exotic talents and stuff is gonna be super annoying, I feel. <laughs> Without uh, especially having the option of re-rolling or anything. Uh, still. But yeah, they, they kind of maybe need to implement that with like NSA tech or something. Uh, because yeah, there's going to be four new exotics in that pool. Uh, all four of them kind of like situational. Poison gas detected. And yeah, it's gonna be uh, entering new location. Difficulty rating. Especially kinetic momentum and and and, and like the healing one, empathic resolve. Like unless you're doing those things, they're not really doing anything for you. And then like regicide is well maybe fun. I don't think it's gonna be useful. <laughs> it's not going to be a, a talent that actually will uh, will be great for like deep runs. Like I would most likely pick it like only if it was like the only choice to pick. But yeah, well, it can help make those uh, like early rooms maybe go faster. Those early rooms aren't the issue anyway. It's like the, the, the late parts. Like if you're going for deep run. <laughs> oh, really? No, come on. I'm like unloading on you, dude. Uh, how are you gonna med pack? Exotic. And you really need to pick a skill, either this loop or the next one. So hopefully there's something choosable. Bomb cam, fire cam, I'm good with either. One of the stickies. Uh <laughs> yeah, let's give him an oxidizer. Yeah, no, let's not. I'll just take the credits. <laughs> As uh, Pomic was thinking about, uh, like, making us uh, redo everything again. Uh, let's take that medium. We're far enough ahead. We're already 8% ahead. So next loop, I'm really hoping to get a skill. Oh yeah, and uh, two waves from now. Uh, I'm really hoping to get a skill that uh, can be used against. Well, yeah, th that will work with the Nemesis fight. Oh yeah, it says in chatter. I totally forgot about it <laughs> again. I'm also curious to see how the Ouroboros is going to go into the game next season. If it goes in as is, it's such a tone-deaf thing to do on the parts of the, of the devs. Room selected. But wouldn't be the first time. Easy. Wouldn't be the first time, but... Hostiles but yeah, each time 
kind of erodes trust even further. That M60. Why am I not just Console. M60 has enough runs for incessant? Should just be using that. So I get even more overwatchy. Mm. Operator authorized to select new room. Yeah. <laughs> As I said, it's going to put us on 84, nice and ahead of uh, making it basically guaranteed that we have uh, Nemesis on loop 5. Or, well, after loop 5. I have one more slot. I want. I need it to kind of be surgical. I don't per se need it to be surgical. Actually, I only have obliterate that goes off of it. You know. But yeah, I'm saving that slot for surgical. Operator clear to select new room. <laughs> oh, let's just do ventilation. Or this will even put us at 90. <laughs> I was even off by a room, so yeah. Constructing. We'll even do all hards on the next one and still make it. I should actually do this. Getting a few stacks of incessant chatter with my pistol going, and then, uh, uh madam. Console active. So, what is my incessant on? It's on nothing? What? That's weird. Operator clear to select new room. Because yeah, the base RPM of this weapon is 500, so it's showing 500 still there. Room selected. <laughs> In zero stacks. Your target. Okay. Same for the MP7 is 950. Hostiles constructing. Hostiles. All the doors on that end. Doors. So we'll just uh, each grab one. There are a few stacks.
can see now showing two stacks, 700. <clears throat> oh, hey. Uh, no glass or uh, no, um, <laughs> no plague. Uh, added these. I'm going to take adaptive. Nice, then we have, uh, yeah, two plagues. Hmm. This is one of these. Some of this. Yeah, I need, really need to grab a skill if I can. And I can, so I will. The rogues will not have any surprises for us. We're gonna take the hard one. Just for the credits. We're so far ahead of the curve. Letting us grab uh, maybe some special ammo and stuff along the way. For the fight. Entering new location. Difficulty rating. Hard. And hearts, all four doors are lit up, so. Hostile construction initiated. One more door than that we're covering, so. Watch yourself. Find a shot on her. Okay. Uh, they don't want to push too far out of position. We're gonna have one more. Where? That's like the medium we have. This will give us four. Uh, we'll be even at Nemesis one one room ahead of. Uh, Entering new location. Difficult ahead medium. of. Medium. We'll go all the way in the back. Yeah, I totally forgot as well. I have a fire camp. I should use it. Come on out. Come on. Come on. It's all fine out here. Oh, this. I used that opportunity seeing that uh, five people spawned next to me to uh, get my incessant chatter going. I think I got the five stacks. Yeah, 1000 RPM on the M60. That's uh, all five stacks. But yeah, I won't, uh, I'll be able to keep it against these enemies, but yeah, not against the... Not against the... the Nemesis's. But I'll have one Mac of uh, extra fast RPM and then... <laughs> then I'll drop back down to normal. 
Oh, that looks like the easy here. It's just uh, it's the same. Same. Chemical hazard activated. Like red, blue, yellow. Entering new location. Difficulty rating easy. Hostiles constructed. Okay, taking that one. I'll take Hostiles this one. Spawn from highlighted doors. And as incessant chatter shows in uh, in uh, in this game mode, the, the power of RPM is uh, pretty significant. It's almost as if if you double the RPM, you double the uh, DPS. Console available. Supply station online. It's almost as if those things are co <laughs> like correlated to each other. There you go. Overwatch 4 even. Um, let's see, do we have any good ammo here? Not really. I'll hold out for stagger rounds. Maybe we'll get some of those. Mm. Let's go take that one all the way in the back, right? There's a few more credits. Chance of the red. I'll grab this Hostiles first door. Constructing. Hostile spawn from highlighted doors. They won't. Hundred percent on the nemesis as well. Oh, <laughs> Overwatch Five that will help out a lot, I think. Don't remember which way we came in, so <laughs> it's always. And we're at the arena. EMP attack simulation online. Entering new room. Difficulty rating. High value target. But like second that door, I'll take Hostile construction initiated. This door. Shot. I own you, To him. Pull it up with a little bit of that. Yeah, on to the Nemesis fight, which will uh, end our journey in this uh, in this run. <laughs> As, uh, we're just in it. Oh, pfft. as I hit reload right away, because of course I do, losing my chatter before I have a chance of using those 60 rounds. Oh, that's fine. 
I wasn't expecting to really have it here anyway. Yeah, buying armor kits and ammo, because yeah, we're not going to be continuing on anyway. I won't be filling up any more slots, so just using it on stuff that, uh, oh, we should. Oh, no, I don't have enough. Never mind. <laughs> but I'd buy those explosive rounds as well, but did not have enough for those. Yeah, it's weird seeing this dude without his uh, normal attire still. It's funny that that still hasn't like become normal to me, having even even after having done a ton of dissenting, <laughs> just Nemesis. seeing my characters without their normal uh, clothes and stuff is uh, still weirding me out. Still after all these days. Hostile construction program. Activating Nemesis. Nemesis. Kind of like how uh, he says that there. Uh, just watch out bunching up as close to each other as you're down there. Serious trauma detected. You won't pushing on the right as well. Uh, Immediate medical assistance needed. No. Agent out of action. So I took uh, multiple stickies to the face. The one on the left is kind of blinded for a second. Um, if we can focus on this one that is close on our left. Because the other one is like way out there. Simulation off by plague. And yeah, we'll uh, exit right here. Just want to see what our time was in total 41 minutes, which isn't super fast, but also isn't very slow or anything. So. As, yeah. And uh, hey there, snakes. <laughs> yeah, we were set up decently well making uh, that fight. Not too bad. I went down. <laughs> we had one down. So it wasn't also completely clean, but uh, it was uh, it was decent. We got the job done. We got the project done, which uh, is the important part. Uh, no reconstructed cash for me. Another agent has joined your group. But, uh... Got some loot. Let's see if anything's useful in there. Agent. Good to be seeing you. <laughs> Another Elmo. Oh, well. Did I say another exotic component? How many do I still have left, actually? Yeah, I'm back up to 60. I did uh, max out, because yeah, I had the scanner pulse at 15 for quite a while. So I maxed out that one to 20, <laughs> just because, uh, you know, why not? And yeah, I'll be getting a bunch of exotics from here anyway, as well as I currently have 11 available from there. I have a bunch from Egg Downtown as well available. And yeah, saving some up, of course, uh, for uh, getting Ouroboros to 
20, getting uh, Bamas uh, to 24 once it's available. Uh, yeah, maybe even uh, splurging on a few other things as well here and there. Um, yeah, I don't know what uh, you guys are maybe interested in running. I would be interested in uh, maybe doing a bunch of countdowns. And, uh, if uh, there are people, other people interested maybe as well in uh, joining, you know, they can, uh, they can uh, tag along for some as well. Oh, it's, uh, Omni got a max roll uh, Bullet King, which, uh, you know, eh. <laughs> it's better than nothing. Bombing swapping characters. Um, actually, I might do the same as I'm... Uh, actually, I'll do a few and this guy. Uh, yeah, because I want to run this Striker PFE. Having, uh, not done so for a while. Yeah, I'll, I'll do that. I'll, I'll run the Striker PFE. As I briefly check as well, as I saw a few messages coming. Another agent is now in your group. But yeah, if anybody else is interested in joining us as well, feel free to say so. Otherwise, we'll uh, start some matchmaking up in a second. I'm gonna check how full up on I am on resources. And okay, not too full. I kind of want to fill up on resources as well before the before. <laughs> new season just to spend them all of course mm, okay yeah and, uh, we'll uh, we'll then uh, just do one and then uh, you can uh, help because yeah we'll likely do a bunch uh, making this a countdown evening kind of thing um with current party i'll, I'll just uh, just to warm up let's just do a challenging one to start off with bump it up as we uh, have more and more people You have received an invite to another agent's group. That's it. You have left the group. Oh, didn't, uh, you are now make us leader, but uh, that's fine on challenging. Also, like, I don't care about being leader. More just surprising somehow. Oh, we do have a target grade on a striker. <laughs> so why not? A ninja striker. That team basically has all forms of strikers. A Tardigate striker, a point man striker. <laughs> yeah, why not? And uh, yeah, I'm gonna guess uh, Omni is running a striker and then Public's running uh, a Redify. And yeah, I'm running striker PFE. Uh, did I not set this thing up to be with Elma? I think I did, right? That FAMAS is just placeholder in there. As you guys' names is. Oh, it's because of that. Uh, <laughs> okay. It's because of the demolitionist uh, thingy. Like the middle icon is coming and going on there. So their names are uh, a little bit jumpy. Is that the demolitionist? I, let me let me just see. Or is it because of survive? Yeah, really soft. That was the demolitionist one. Uh, oh no, it's this thing. Oh yeah, it's from the survivalist tackling. That's what's uh, causing it. It's weird that it's active, inactive, active, inactive, like that. As I will jump into a few countdowns, uh, do some farming, <laughs> attempt to get some Uzinas, uh, get some closers, get some uh, setups. Communication relay offline. Okay, oh, yeah, that thing is still very much my goal. And I've also been looking into scheduling in. Uh, the run for the third account. Infiltrated the power plant. 
They triggered a lockdown. Likely it will be in 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 a week because yeah, the weekends are a little bit messy for me for me to be able to plan it in there. Transformers and restore the power grid. And I'll likely do uh, two 12-hour streams, not one 24-hour one, because reactor unstable. Emergency lockdown. I don't want to die. Is, is, the, is the answer there? I don't want to kill myself accidentally. Uh, but yeah, no, I, I'll be likely yeah, doing them two 12-hour streams back to back. Uh, I'm basically seeing. I think that would be a cool uh, kind of like challenge thing of like how far uh, can you know, an experienced player take an account in 24 hours. And yeah, especially of course as well, I'll be detouring for all of the loots and stuff, so I'll be going a little bit slower than... than, <laughs> than you know, then you really could. Then I'll try to make up for it by like knowing what to do, hopefully. Because actually, I don't know what to do as well. <laughs> I haven't leveled up uh, on, uh, on uh, somebody has measured there as their uh, as their RPMs went ups and downs. That uh, Rogue defender drone what is that defender drone? Defender drone. I will never understand players like that. Um, uh, yeah, containment uh, reactor seems like an obvious thing. I now noticed that, yeah. Three of those players on the other team are uh, clanmates. Oh, it's there. <laughs> I uh, aimed incorrectly. kill here will uh, have this one completed. Didn't get which one didn't we get then? Oh. I'll take the long way around and get that thing. Not that it's an important one, I think it's explosive increase, but uh, yeah, there's no reason to leave a directive when we uh, don't need to. Which one is this even? It is, yeah, it is explosive damage. But that also increases explosive damage towards us, so that's not a that's not a bad deal. While it is while it is a red, basically. And uh, hey there's been Shade Tech detected. See them going for that one, I'll go for this one. Oh, 
I'll just hang out in here for now. Rogue sniper turret detected. Hostile sniper turret detected. Rogue assault turret detected. Host Ten minutes to lock down. Evacuate the facility. Power I'm just gonna go up here. Incoming. High risk hostile. Because yeah, I saw that na th those names here always like go in the back there and stuff. It's much easier to shoot them from up here, and of course the chest is up here. So area secure. Or a chest position is up here. So <laughs> went to check that one uh, as well right away. Um, it's not this one, so it's by uh, by the stairs over there. Also got uh, easy miners, easy mains, making this uh, easy. Agent, you've reached the turbine. I need you to fix the power grid. You're in. We need to switch the power over to the new grid. No idea why they would engage from all the way out there. I'm just gonna go for the. Uh, I was gonna say I might turn around because they might go for the objective. But they took the killing, so I, 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 I went for the objective. You're gonna need to expose the transformers and remove any busted fuses. Power surge imminent. Follow emergency procedures to protect against. Watch your step, Agent. See some allies over there. Don't see any allies over there, so I'll go for that one. And I'll just take this shock hit here. <laughs> Didn't get shocked. Interesting. And the chest is by the stairs there, likely. Yeah. You know what? I'll go pop it just so everybody sees it. <laughs> and uh, hey there, uh, hey there, Merc. As yeah, the, indeed, the Breaker plus Elmo meta is uh, yeah very much alive in here. Although I'm not running it in in its meta setup, so I'm being contrarian and off meta, as I often am. As I'm running a PFE version. But yeah, I'm, I'm doing uh, pretty good uh, over here in Division Land. I, I heard uh, and well, saw as well, uh, you were playing a bunch of Destiny I saw. Mm. Ah, so close, so close. Uh, I might pick it up just for sharing. Alright guys, we're getting the grid down. I'm just gonna go murder on this side. You see those heals coming in, but I'm being a bad ally and not sticking in them, so... But yeah, this fight's basically over anyway, so we can just uh, run through everyone. Oh, another main. Great work, Agent. The power plant is stable. Maybe, maybe, maybe. Who knows? When you're ready, oh. send up a flare. That one's. Can pick you up. Oh, oh, that wasn't even a setup. That was that was a profit thanks to a backpack. Our extraction is going to be uh, east because uh, we came in the other two. We came in north and west, so. So that's pretty close to here. 
making it uh, hopefully not too hard. I'm just gonna wait for some more allies. Agent, stay frosty. Hunters incoming. I'm mostly as well like <laughs> people of the team that I went in with. Yeah, I'm trying to find things to do in here, maybe. Well, I mean, no, well, you, you guys <laughs> went quite hard <laughs> from <laughs> uh, going uh, after all those uh, legendary runs and stuff. Uh, for me as well, indeed, yeah. The, I've been giving myself things to do with, with indeed, YouTube and, and, uh, uh, and Twitch and stuff. But also, yeah, I always, like, made my own fun in here. Running purple bills, running stuff to not make it easier but harder. <laughs> but yeah, I can totally see as well the, the other side of it of uh, running out of things to do, especially if. Uh, like, System curtailed. You very much as you guys played it in a competitive sense. Hunter loot back there, but I'll do some killing first and then come back for that part later. But yeah, also, always for me, like, Division was more about, like, making builds and stuff, which <laughs> is a little bit more infinite than uh, trying to, like, uh, you know, the, the, the execution end of it or content end of it. Didn't get one shot on target there, everybody died too fast. Uh... Most of our times have been eaten, so now I guess we could go back and <laughs> we're all playing different things now. Are you doing raids with stream or something, by the way? Uh, no, I haven't been in the raiding scene for quite a while. So, I've been thinking about getting back into it, but uh, also, yeah, I would need to basically relearn. Like, well, uh, Dark Hours, I know. But, uh, I would kind of need to re relearn uh, Iron Horse, as I uh, have not done it in uh, quite a while, <laughs> quite a long while. And even the, the more recent runs of mine were mostly on like, you know, just door duty and stuff like that. So Especially the raids were something where, yeah, just mostly because of being clanless as well. I just didn't partake for quite a while. Ready for extraction. But yeah, indeed, yes. A lot of you guys, as times I saw, <laughs> getting uh, surpassed with some uh, tactics and stuff. Um, do we get one more? We get, uh, kind of get one more. We have to grab loot and go. But... Oh, just run away. We linked up both teams, so we should get full coins 158 yeah. nice work you stabilized the power grid in this room. Oh, yes i did barely nothing there as I, <laughs> I was running around as a headless chicken most of it which is not uncommon for me i i hit a few objectives <laughs> i contributed 
But yeah, yeah, indeed. I think you guys need to uh, get back at it and uh, get your times back. And yeah, we're going to keep this train rolling and doing some more countdown. So for those interested maybe in uh, in a spot, feel free uh, to say so. And uh, we'll get you in here. Um. Another agent has joined your group. As, uh, we can even take it all the way up to eight spots uh, if, uh, if need be, so... And yeah, feel free to just join on me, Mighty. Yeah. For those that have me on the list, feel free to just uh, um, join on me first. Because yeah, we'll fill up one group and then just make make it over into a raid group and then get others in if need be. Another agent is now in your group. And yeah, let's take it up to Heroic as well, as we'll be taking in four people. Right, so the press and hold, I always forget. You have left the group. Another agent has joined your group. Thanks for the business. Yeah, I don't know if uh, you're still interested as well. Uh, the, well I'll, I'll just uh, invite you in. Is it? Omni was with us with the last run. What else did this character even have? Is it? There's that PFE. I mean, technically, this Red Patriot could kind of work. <laughs> kind of. Uh, the PFE is more useful, honestly. Likely after this one, I'll uh, swap characters. Um, no, uh, that uh, that wouldn't be an issue at all. Uh, uh, although, yeah, uh, easiest would be if uh, he can send me a friend's invite and he can tell me their name. Or I can send them a friend invite if you give me the name, which you just did. So I'll do that. Because yeah, in, gra in raid groups, uh, we do need to do it with friend's invites. Yeah, there we've uh, filled up to five already. Some of these running and going. Mm. Don't know if they've accepted mine yet. Double check. Hmm. I will check with them if they, uh, because I did send the, okay, there we go. They, I'll uh, get them in here. And, uh, what? Is it? Another agent has joined your group. We had uh, five of us on team. Hmm. I think I'll move, uh, Muddy over because yeah you two are running uh strikers keeping one strikers on each team uh one full strikers one buff field and then this pfe uh i'll start matchmaking for now and uh, there's one to join uh, later on uh, feel free to say so as right, so we'll fill up the rest with matchmaking Another agent is now in your group. That's pretty fast. That it's filling up. Let's so have a spotter high and red and and uh, 
Um, okay. No, that's actually good. They can stay on that end. Uh, helping with the hunters on that end, I'll be helping with the hunters on this end, keeping them busy. Let's just wait for that last player to join us. And yeah, I'm not going to be very picky here. Uh, this is fine. I mean, that was, that was just a good striker. That, that wasn't even fine. That was good. <laughs> uh, so basically, I'll only kick uh, like if several K players are running like six pieces or like very low level players with like just non super non builds on heroic. It just gets in the way too much. But what I should be better about is actually telling them why I'm kicking them, especially if they're low-level players. The high-level ones with, like, <laughs> several K players running six pieces, that just, just... They should know better, but... But yeah, low-level players, they should just go countdown on challenging, where you only need a few people to have decent builds to run it. Looks like they've triggered the lockdown protocols right. while they were charging their warhead. Because we'll be fighting Black Dusk all the way through. We need to get control of the experimental reactor. Yeah, I'm going to take a right and link up both teams, which is nice. Don't get close range buff, though. We actually don't get any of the good damage buffs. We only get the crit chance one. Which is actually good for me, <laughs> and not for many of the builds on the, on the team. But actually, well, we'll likely have multiple Coyotes active, so not even that. System I didn't get to stack to 200. <laughs> actually, we have uh, all three Coyote ranges there. <laughs> so we're getting jammed by the reactor next to us. Uh, I'm going to leave that up to other people to get. Because I'll be going and being in this guy's face. Waiting for my allies a little bit. Uh, I'll take that hit. And, uh... We'll have an out of combat in between anyway. But you have to watch out because uh, the alt gate will not reset right away. System. But what I'll do here is uh, let's have a former with us, so uh, not even necessary, really. System malfunctioning. Hmm. So what's the final? Let's go do containment first. Meaning that uh can do reactor a second uh and then uh end up at the lab. The target should be nearby. Already, I heard the, <laughs> the loot drop in the distance there, so I'm gonna double back and get this. Maybe I should, yeah. Uh, uh, when I sub characters, I'll, I'll do that. I'll uh, empty up uh, some space to uh, to actually be able to uh, uh, loot on the like just loot into inventory instead of checking on the. Checking on the ground. Oh, that's why it filled up to seven. Those two are in a in a clan together. Yeah, 
they joined as a two-man group. Detected. And our hostiles always does also take take a little while. It does have uh, flame rounds. Hostile a little bit more dangerous. Incoming. High risk hostile. An agent needs assistance. Why do so many of the names have <laughs> special ammo? Oh, these bastards. Oh yeah, for most of this fight I have been at 200 stacks. So I've been actually playing the striker part correctly. Just gonna put some shots over there. That dog. Just kill this thing as it'll stay alive for a while otherwise. That better be the last wave, is that <laughs> we killed quite a lot. Ten minutes to lock down yeah, onto the reactor. And then the lab uh, to end it off. And the team is more than strong enough to easily get extraction, I I think. Well, of course, yeah, we took five <laughs> people in uh, in a coordinated way, so it should be expected at that point. Shade tech detected. Mm, seeing as it is, oh, I'll wait a little bit and punch up a little bit. But on this one, I'm not adverse to rushing in because I can go into circles, just sit there. Start pushing the enemies out. Yeah, the downside with this striker PFE is always this thing of just in between fights, of course, where. Uh, I'm actually going to push out. Plenty of people in the circle. Rogue striker drone detected. Hostile striker drone detected. The chest is underneath. Rogue sniper turret detected. Hostile sniper turret detected. High risk yeah. target approaching. <laughs> went, uh, ring around the rosy uh, there with me. Yeah, the SHD one isn't too bad if everybody just gets in the circles and uh, we get it done quickly. Okay, it can go pretty fast. Agent, you should be able to access that experimental lab now. Yeah, so on to lab. Which I think... Mm, is it the longest main? I think it is, right? On average. I suppose you have so much running around to do with it. And it's like such a big area. Because this one is actually like really big. It's just that it's like circle around the outside mostly. <laughs> uh, the area. I'm gonna go this way. Now, just need to find and destroy those fuel valves. Mostly gonna focus on. Oh yeah, that's the one I shoot coming in. I was like, there's one I shoot coming in. That's this one, because everybody always forgets this one. So we'll go around and shoot it from here.
Magnetic containment failure. Elevated threat of EMP discharge. Nice work on the valves. Now, I need you to expose the reactor. It's likely that chest over there. Actually, there's some people in this. So I'll, uh, I'll let them get it. Oh, yeah, it's by the stairs. Now, you just need to destroy the magnetic core. You should be fine. System disrupted. High risk target detected. System restored. Then over here, and then it's over there in the back. Hostile incinerator turret detected. My ally is thinking it's all right for sure. Used a bunch of SHTs uh, uh, calibrations, so going out of my way to get the chests and <laughs> fill back up a little. This thing doesn't have the biggest punch. Especially on heroic. Oh yeah, still I can do like deal with stuff like this. Just keep them busy. Have everything shoot at me and not at my allies. moments like this I'm just gonna push through this and then go help get the oh, buttons gotten already Just need to secure the area and we'll uh, still have uh, 2 minutes 30 to. Uh, we'll still have 3 minutes. We would have had, well, we had 3 minutes left. Yeah. We would have run out of time. Even for, yeah, we, we tried to go fast. We didn't even really uh, hang around too long on any objectives or anything, and we still <laughs> didn't have like a ton of time left. It's kind of how how heroic counter kind of goes quite often. Nice, the plant's secure. And yeah, if uh, let's get you out of too here. many people to don't exact. pay attention, then it can actually go bad. Torres is waiting for your signal. Shoot off a flare when you're ready to come home. So here we'll get a fresh four minutes for the extraction, regardless of uh, how much you had left. Mm, and the extraction is gonna be oh, east, so yeah, we we have a we do have a big run to make. So gonna start running. Hoping whoever's at the lead there is uh, <laughs> not going to instantly engage, but it's likely to be. Uh, I, it's Omni, so <laughs> they know. Uh, yeah, yeah, we will indeed hold up here and uh, bunch up and go in as a big group. The last two are in range as well. We can we can go. System malfunctioning. 
Agent, stay frosty. Hunters incoming. So there's always one here as well. <clears throat> it's hoping to get my shield up before meeting him, which I usually do, but uh yeah, I mistimed how much time I had on the on the on the jamming. That blind is very annoying. Yeah, yeah. Wanted to go after the healing box guy, but uh, couldn't there. But I'll just go after the healing box instead. Double back and uh, start working on these guys. Okay. Now I'm going to go loot. Surprisingly few. Uh, <laughs> surprisingly few uh, named items from uh, targeted. Well, let's have that. Yeah, that's the downside of hunting unicorns. Uh, just make sure as well that we do signal. Yeah. <laughs> as we did, uh, we did uh, one time not long ago forget to actually signal extraction. And uh, hey there, Sunset King. And uh, sub to you as well, as uh, I'm doing uh, pretty good. Just uh, doing some farming, attempting to get uh, closer. And also had a decently good day. Was uh, productive. Got some stuff done work-wise, and uh, freed up some time for tomorrow to uh, maybe make a video. So, I, well, I have, pl I have plenty of time tomorrow, so I should be able to make a video. I have basically from the afternoon all the way till I start streaming free. So <laughs> uh, that should be enough time to uh, get a rambling talk together. And maybe as well uh, prepare uh, something, uh, well, the stats and stuff, or what I want to talk about. Oh, yeah. chopper. It's, it's time to leave. Uh, yeah, I want to prepare a uh, build showcase uh, and maybe uh, do that uh, Do that live. Maybe Friday, maybe Monday. Maybe, well, well, maybe Sunday as well. <laughs> we'll see. Well, I'll pick a day. But I haven't, uh, uh, I haven't really uh, considered which build I want to do, kind of, which is uh, has been the habit of the last ones. You just did the countdown for the first time last week. Oh, that is. Uh, well, we all uh, start uh, somewhere, so uh, did. Uh, that's it. I've done uh, at this point many thousands of ones. <laughs> so, well, no, not many thousands. I don't think I've done a thousand, most likely not. But hundreds, likely. Yeah, they are. They are quite fun. Uh, I'm gonna swap character briefly. So uh, sorry, Pomo. Be right back. <laughs> I do want to have access to a few different builds. Um, I think I'll just grab. I just think I'll grab her, and then I have that PFE, I have Striker, and... Uh, I kind of want to run run one build as a Striker. Just full Striker. Just striker, Striker. Doing some, some damaging. And also, if... 
anybody is interested in joining us as you are there we went in with uh five people uh just so we're going out already to and uh, we're huh? gonna be doing a few heroic ones and uh, for those interested uh, feel free to uh, say so and we'll get you guys uh, into here as well yet uh, uh salty wasn't in the last one i don't know if he wants to maybe join us but uh right how am i omni muddy and miser Another agent is now. Oh, and uh, salty ones in as well. So uh, get him in as well on oh, no, SC2. So <laughs> and uh, hello to both of you as well. Well, oh, actually, yeah, hello to SE. I've already said hello to Spoon, but he, he gets to have two hellos. So that's not a that's not an issue. Uh, so yeah, salty, uh, Omni, and SE. Has joined your so yeah, we have a seven out of eight. So if anybody else is interested in joining us for for heroic countdown, then uh, feel free to say so. Otherwise, we'll be grabbing a random. So I briefly check actually what is equipped on this character. Uh, it is her tech tank. Uh, I'm gonna run a chest striker. Let's let's see if I can make a chest striker work once, <laughs> once, uh, once in a while. Mm. And uh, just to check as well, so yeah, this is on a striker, yeah, striker, uh, salty is on a heartbreaker, but he's OD, as he said there, uh, miser was a striker, and uh, uh, Pamuk is right You know what? I'll I'll uh, I'll put Miser with Omni because uh, yeah, they were uh, they're 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 clanmates. So then they're together. Um, uh, let me see if I didn't miss anyone. Yeah. So we'll uh, yeah fill up that last slot with some matchmaking. Hmm. Wait, that was wrong? Which one, which one was wrong? <laughs> but yeah, as well, we have so much power in this team. Apparently that's like, build-wise, doesn't really matter. We'll, we'll get through it. As I later on, I might actually yeah, grab a PFE as well. But for now, I'm, I'm in the mood to, uh, to do some damaging, to do some murdering. And uh, there is no bigger murderer in the DPS space than uh, than, <laughs> than Chest Striker. Although, of course, Chest Strikers need to stack to 200, which uh, <clears throat> isn't always viable. But Countdown, Heroic Countdowns are somewhere where I do feel it's viable. Uh, as we get uh, this guy. Uh, thing is, he's 904. Like, this build, if you told me this build is from someone that is that is level 50, I kind of would have believed you. But it's fine. It's fine. Uh, He'll he'll just enjoy his time and have an easy run for once in his life. <laughs> Is it that that was not a build? Uh, it had four pieces of striker, so it'll still do well. It had the backpack, so communication relay offline. <laughs> Beat that guy to the hunters, yeah, just sacrificially, yeah. Oh, you guys want a hunter? You, you hunters want the agent kill? Uh, yeah, take this guy. It's fine. You'll be doing him a favor. You'll be putting him out of his misery. He's responding north. 
So I'm just gonna instantly check. Okay. <laughs> the game is being uh, nice to us. Although I should wait. Uh, yeah. We can take a right and we can link up. Minutes lockdown. Trojan virus detected. Safety protocols activated. <laughs> Also, ah, the, I should have, I should have swapped uh, uh, Omni and Salty there. Uh, the the SHD levels are going like from like uh, 17k, 6k. Uh, oh, I suddenly realized what build I am and what build I'm not, uh, which is not BFE, which I'm so used to playing here. But yeah, it's it's like going like it's like whoop whoop uh, uh, the. It's like going from uh, from large number to small number, and then back from small number to high number on the other team. <laughs> Although, well, yeah, except except for two people that uh, should have soft spaces. But yeah, I'm just gonna do that and go through here and try to get to uh, high stacks, but I didn't. Taking cover just to not block everybody behind me. Because when you're blind firing like that, you're a lot easier to miss. And at the four at the fourth hunter, I hit uh, 200 stacks. <laughs> because yeah, the team 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 is strong. As yeah, we'll go containment. We'll go lab. If I read that right, at least. Let me double check once this is away. Uh, yeah. We'll be skipping reactor. Uh, in the best one of max screen range for the library. Last thing I need. Oh, max optimal here. Okay. Uh, no, I'll keep an eye out, but yeah, it's very unlikely without targeted pistols. And yeah, those are always uh, can take a while. Oh, we didn't get the other Soviets. Usually one of those things indeed that uh, becomes like the last things that you need is third stats that isn't really useful <laughs> on, on like a pistol or I think one of mine was like mag size on ARs is like the very last thing I needed and it took me forever. Mostly because as well I wasn't like target farming ARs at all because I had like the ARs I was after. Might have been SMGs, actually. Might have been mag, mag size SMG. Uh, yeah. Uh, On to uh, lab. Which is this front. Which I'm kind of looking forward as well with the third account doing uh, some messing about with uh, with that, with uh, get it, trying to see how fast I can get proficiency up to like 14, 15. Uh, how fast I can get uh, uh, the recalc uh, library kind of filled. But, uh, likely for... Uh, Like from when I make the account and then uh, do that like two 12 hour streams with it. Likely the following streams will also just be with that account for uh, most of it. Just um, running about seeing like, yeah, how how blueprint getting and stuff. How Shade tech detected. 
uh, getting spec points and stuff. Ten minutes. And then, yeah, mostly I will be turning a lot of the things I learned from it uh, into uh, a few videos. Uh, and I'm mostly, yeah, basically going into like how how I. Uh, as I like went through the proficiency, how I uh, mostly couching it in that as well, just so that it's like it's not because I won't be going for the most optimal things to do with a lot of them because I won't be like level farming or anything. Uh, but more like what my ways of doing it were and I'm just hopefully that's uh, useful to people Barely missed this guy. So I'm gonna go down from that. He had special ammo as well, of course. Area secure. Agent, head to the administration building. So I'm kind of looking forward to that third account, doing that run. <laughs> The, the thing is, as well, that I've been kind of debating with myself is, uh, do I kind of maybe do a few hours of it already, like the start of it, and kind of like, or maybe even look at, I don't know if there are guides for like that kind of stuff, or like people have made like videos about, like I'm not sure if I want to do, try to plan it all out. Currently, I kind of want to do it kind of blind, just... Uh, on the spot, just go in. Well, not blind, of course, not not actually blind, because that's that's kind of impossible for me at this point. Agent, you've reached the administration building. Right, yeah, we're gonna push in. Uh, I'll go for uh, the comms right away. As you yeah, will be going in from the from this side, so just run past these guys and go inside. Do you need to do that I know it's your favorite job. Need you to I should probably get getting it all, all cover. Warning. System breach. Initiating safety protocol. Chess is here as well. But yeah, I think I will likely do that. Just uh, not prepare, really. Uh, also to just save myself time. Because, <laughs> yeah, I could, of course, like... Uh, well, I, if I really wanted to, I could maybe find the time of just uh, doing a boosted run or something. From, from low level. And having some, like, ideas of how... Like which which route I want to take. Also, I think it would be more fun just going in blind and just winging it. Because I already kind of know that uh, I I did kind of keep an eye on time uh, last time that I did uh, uh, when I did that world tier character on my alt account, and I was like, I did some calls for backup. Uh, but I remember it being like around like 11 and a half hours or something for uh, zero to um, from DC start to like uh, and from there to starting um, uh, warlords. Incoming high risk hostile.
<laughs> here, even without any of the good damage buffs. Although, well, we, we do have an ongoing directive in the team. We do have a future initiative in the team. Um, but yeah, I was uh, at points hitting for 2 million without even like close range buff. Which, yeah, that... Uh, Like a chest striker still can do kind of those kind of stuff, but yeah, you have to play it to its strengths. You have to stack it up high. Which turns out into one of those things of like, is it really, do you really need it? And you know, it's not that. It can do the damage. Should be the last wave. Yeah. Which is the point, of course, that uh, I usually go down is exactly the last wave, wasting my hive just before <laughs> the hunters. <laughs> and I'm gonna go. Uh, my team has this. I'm gonna go loot a little bit just so I can catch up. That's it. It's just one guy left. Why are we still getting waves? Could have stopped spawning waves uh, and we. Oh well, should spawn a name. It didn't spawn a name with this wave either. I get a feeling we might have bugged the game. That is weird. Because yeah, we uh, we are still spawning names, uh, or are we still spawning waves without names, without that named. Uh, well, I mean, loot wise, this is still fine. Because yeah, we're getting to farm loot here, but this will likely go up until the point when we will fail on time. Because officially we're not done with the objective. I have seen this in the past, but I haven't seen this in quite a while that it like infinite spawned anything. Uh, you know what? Just out of curiosity, I'm just gonna see if any of these things are maybe in. I mean, likely not. Great work, Agent. The power plant is stable. Wait, what? Uh, when you're ready, send up a flare can pick you up. Extraction started and then this wave spawned. Oh well, this wave spawned and then let's see if we kill this wave if we actually stop spawning stuff. Because yeah, we need to get out of here as well. Because yeah, we need we need to go to extraction. Is that another wave that it spawned? It, yeah. Uh, let's grab our loot and just uh, move towards extraction because uh, this this is keeping spawning. So <laughs> and uh, we need time to extract. So yeah, uh, let's head on out. And the extraction is going to be uh, uh, east again. We came in north and west. And I see most of the people pushing out, so that's good. Well, yeah, of course, seven of us should uh, <laughs> be uh, you know, be within earshot of me, at least. And Pomic said that as well. And, yeah. As it, let's uh, hold up here. And have a few more people. Mm. Yeah, once SE is here, we kind of need to push in because we're also short on time. Yeah, let's uh, let's head in. Oh, 
Oh, our uh, System, not our puppy did not uh, get the message, and he uh, he went down. He will likely die there because he's about to go down again. Well, weekend. Yeah, that's what happened there. And that uh, dying <laughs> while well, this timer has started from any point, uh, like from any source of death. Like it doesn't. Yeah, doesn't need to be during the extraction. It's just while once the extraction timer has started, uh, you die. You're you're dead. Which uh, is a sentence that uh, makes more sense than it should, uh, it seems. Oh well, makes sense if you know <laughs> what I mean. Torres is waiting for your signal. Shoot off a flare when you're ready. Shouldn't be as aggressive as I am. System not functioning. That will make it work. An agent mm. in We have the chopper coming down as well. I'm gonna double back for these guys. Kind of getting messy. Still salvageable. Mm. Being shot in the back there, which is dangerous. Make sure that I at least get all the dog tags and the loot, and so should you guys. Be sure to uh, is in position. get your loots. As also. Yeah, just watch out on this wave that uh, you're close enough for extraction. But also, yeah, let's just extract. So nine, eight, let's get out of here. Yeah, indeed, uh, as well, I've... Well, I've, I've seen that before, not in that spot, but it's also been, like, months. It's pretty uh, sure we're gonna lose the power plant. Um, that infinite spawn happening. Um, I'm trying to remember, like, like I remember it being on reactor or something, and kind of having the same issue. Like we were past the the secure, the final, and then it was interesting that it fixed itself. I remember at that time it kept spawning stuff till uh, till we basically failed on time, and then had to extract. Good to see you. But yeah, that time, luckily, at least, it seemed to time out, uh, and and uh, agent has joined your group. and just give us the completion, which was good. <laughs> Not in that. Oh uh, well, I mean, in the Anderson mission, you could force it to to do that, but I never did the. <laughs> I. Um, well, actually, I, I shouldn't say I never did it. I did it once, uh, just to understand how it was done. Because yeah, so, yeah, I'll set up another heroic countdown and uh, take present party into it already. And um, I'll invite uh, all that were in it already, leaving uh, one spot if anybody else is interested in uh, joining us for for some uh, for some. This list is always annoying and moving around way too much. 
So the another agent has joined <laughs> your Such an annoying list. As I think uh yeah, that was all seven of us that were there. Mm, and uh, hey there, Wienerville. <laughs> yeah, indeed. Once it started bugging out like that, well, luckily we got most of the people out. Uh, we lost that. Uh, we lost our one puppy. And uh, as yeah, so I'll uh, start the matchmaker. I don't think uh, if uh, somebody wants to join, they can uh, still uh, say so. Another agent is now in your group. Or well, we'll be doing a few more as well. Uh, and so we get uh, well, a good-looking striker, although with uh, Eagle Bear, which is a weird choice. As I, I'll keep wanting to go to map to start countdown, but it's it's not there, so I need to just remember to do it from here. Yeah, we'll uh, head in once more. I don't actually do any like sorting of the teams. But <laughs> uh, Sydney at fifteen, but we still had for two. Uh, yeah, I didn't actually notice when, when like the signal went up or if it was on time or not. But yeah, I think it was just likely a panic, <laughs> panic signal, <laughs> which, uh, you know, we got out, we got all our loot, we got uh, all of the tags and stuff, so it went fine in the end. I said that one as well was was uh, uh, one of the reasons <clears throat> uh, because it has basically two streams. The teams got kind of split up, and our damage became very um, like spread out. So we were just all fighting one on one once, where it's much better to be bunched up as a team and just you know kill this enemy and then kill this enemy. <laughs> but sometimes that goes naturally. Sometimes it doesn't. Uh, taken over the power plant and triggered the lockdown procedures. Be careful, Agent. Last thing we need is an RC bomb in a nuclear reactor. Oh, was it so very early? Okay. We need to shut down the broken transformers and... I didn't catch who called it in. Reactor unstable. Uh, we should take a left to uh, a bunch of both teams. So, uh, shoot that. They likely are not on comms with us, although hopefully they will understand when they actually see that they are alone. Uh, let's just head in here. Oh, that didn't reach. <laughs> and, uh, I, I want a refund. That did reach that. <laughs> that store, I shouldn't. Uh, I shouldn't. Uh, I'm gonna go grab the dog tags as well from here already. My team should do that as well in a second. Because, yeah, make sure that you get all the dog tags. Because, yeah, we're not coming back that way because all of the other stuff is on the other end. As you get uh, greedy on the last run and didn't extract in the end. Yeah, that's always a danger. Oh, yeah, it kind of depends on uh, how good uh, you are on uh, countdown credits already. Uh, as you hear, we'll get the close range buff and this will make it uh, a lot easier. Okay, so. Uh, Reactor and cooling, then, looks like. Yeah, reactor and cooling. Shade tech detected. Hmm. 
Let's actually, with uh, close range buff, I'm going to uh, become a normal striker. Because uh, I won't be stacking to 200 with. <laughs> Everything will be dead by the time that I uh, stack to 200. Striker drone detected. Rogue sniper turret detected. I'll go get, in, get into this circle. Sniper turret detected. An agent has gone offline. Oh, I see he crashed out there. Hostile assault turret detected. Rogue incinerator turret detected. Hostile incinerator turret detected. Mm. Agent down. Incoming. High risk hostile. Chest is underneath. Stairs. <laughs> that was, uh... Area secure. Uh... And yeah, indeed, that's it. it uh, looks like you have indeed uh, crashed out there. Let me go grab that loot over there as well. Let's see, next up, cooling tower. And that's our uh, main is in the turbine. So I'll uh, fix up the camera as well. At least this one in, in cooling tower should be pretty fast because uh, most of the things are shootable from entry from here. Ten minutes to lock down. Evacuate the facility. Redirect excessive power to stabilize power distribution. Because uh, both of the servers are kind of shootable from uh, from up here. Here. So I saw that the red lamp in the corner of my eye. Incoming. The sniper hound ready to fire, which. Uh, it's always nice and scary. Area secure. Agent, you should be able to access the turbine and now. The chest is by where the boss was. That loot doesn't have a chevron, a named chevron, so do it. <laughs> Let's uh, head down in and start working on the power grid. Yeah, it is indeed annoying that. Uh, if you crash out, well, same with Descent as well, like, if you crash out there, you don't get to rejoin. Same for Countdown, you don't get to rejoin. But yeah, likely it's done uh, without ways around it. There are, like, easy ways of uh, cheating the system. As they found out with Descent, for instance. <laughs> it was one of the... 
major Agent, you've reached SHD farms that existed recently. Okay, let's wait up and uh, not go in with just a few of us. It's also likely it just... Uh, it would just also likely take some implementation and they likely didn't want to spend that time. Yeah. Well, so then we have uh, enough people there now. To at least not get in. instantly killed. Need to switch the power over to the new grid. Yeah, I went to objective hunting right away. Detected with transformers. Safety protocols activated. You're gonna need to expose and the transformers and remove any. Chest is by the. By the stairs over there. Accidental electrocution. What the hell was that? I think the floor is electrified. Watch your step, Agent. Redirect excessive power to stabilize power distribution. I'm gonna take a heal here. We're already on that one. That's nice. Killing some fishes. <laughs> yeah, they're only twelve hundred. Incoming. As a uh, stagnant to one hundred is a lot more reliably done, and that's the reason we go with. Obliterate strikers over chest strikers so often. Evacuate the facility. Five minutes to lock down. Is that what I... You're good to go. Just need to switch over to the new grid. On this run, like I definitely could not give it just random sacrifice. <laughs> give me closers, game. Get me closer to that closer. Uh the someone going for the button so oh so instead i will uh, run into a group of enemies and then realize that i'm in danger and then murder them all that I have no good idea about and I actually maybe should uh, have a look at <laughs> like keeping data on it's how much more uh, an, an heroic countdown gives in XP over the challenging one because I feel the heroic one does give more that much is noticeable like usually you get a level and a half, meaning that you quite often get two levels out of a heroic one, where with a challenging one, like it seems less than a level. <laughs> you usually get one every two runs, I feel. But yeah, not, not something that I've ever like really put the numbers on. It's, uh, we have the Western extraction, of course, so. We have a bunch of a run to do. And yeah, we'll push up to um, around here-ish and then wait. Mm. 
<laughs> yeah, it would be nice indeed if we could reconnect. But yeah, the things with those kind of things is also like annoyances of like, where do you put someone when they reconnect? Because do you put them on the on the group leader? Because that, that could be dangerous. <laughs> group leader could be in danger. Do you put them uh, just somewhere outside? Then they like have to all the way catch up. Like, what is here? Let's head on in. Hey. <laughs> That's it. And there I show that I've played uh, way too many countdowns by uh, bombing the guy with the grenade. So we'll have a hunter on this left side. And yeah, two of them made made it back into the into here. System. We can prioritize the hunters first. See any vital signs critical. I'm heal up first and then I'm gonna get this guy. Shoot off a flare when you're ready for Torres to bring you home. Push uh, up to here. It's dangerous because, yeah, especially grenadiers can really annoy you. But I don't really have a fallback position here. So. Yeah, we need to be a little bit close to make our close range buffs work. So we'll just uh, do that by uh, being close. One last enemy here, and then doubling back for the chopper right away. There we go. And yeah, heroic extractions can be uh, can be hard. Yeah. Another bad closer. I should have kept count at some point, maybe. <laughs> how many how many closers have I gotten that uh, aren't the one that I'm after? Because I very much feel I'm likely now beyond uh, beyond the average point. Did we forget to? <laughs> I wasn't I wasn't paying attention either. No <laughs> heat. Uh, well. And yeah, those those kind of things can happen. As we uh forgot to call in extraction as we were all too busy uh, murdering and running around and looting. <laughs> as yeah, I, I I I am notorious for not paying attention to the timer at all anyway. So uh, safe area detected. Uh, yeah, that is, uh, doing it uh, too late uh, leaves it up to, uh, up to lag, basically, uh, taking, taking it. Uh, like, it, it depends, basically, at that point on how much lag there is, and then apparently there was a little bit too much of it. But, yeah, we still get, even failing to uh, do the extraction correctly basically we still get our loot anyway so uh, uh, we only get less uh, you have left the group uh, less another agent Did I do that correctly that was that was heroic right oh yeah so uh, get the team back in as I'll do that mm. one salty and SE. Another agent has joined your group. Yeah, once again as well, if anybody is wanting to join us, as we have one spot available still, and uh, yeah, uh, feel free to say so, and we can uh, get you in here and get to... Uh, we'll take a full group uh, at that point. As yeah, we'll be just doing some heroic count adding. <laughs> yeah, indeed, it, it does happen <laughs> from time to time. Sadly. I guess, um, I'm just as much to blame as well on those because uh, I 
usually don't pay well attention to timers as I'm mostly talking at those points. Thing as uh, doesn't seem to be, uh, I will uh, grab uh, some. Uh, we will grab a random by uh, finding more agents, and uh, it found more agents. Another agent has joined your group. Wait, what? Headshot. You know what? It's fine. It's fine. Keep going to the map again to start Canton, where I don't need to be. I can do it from there. Oh shit! An agent has left your group. No, uh, what? What happened? Why do I need to? Go? Oh, uh, if you have a turning PFE, just keep it for for your own. Uh, that's uh, th those are rare and uh, well earned. Uh, it, when you get them, you don't have to. <laughs> you don't have to like. Uh, I would feel burdened taking that uh, from anybody. Uh, just <laughs> well, I mean, uh, hang on to it. Maybe you'll uh, you'll make a PFE eventually. But yeah, those, those are pretty rare and uh, hard to come by. And uh, like, I have plenty already. Uh, I would I would feel bad <laughs> taking <laughs> taking them uh, from anyone. Uh, but yeah, if you're if somebody else wants it and uh, you're willing to give it up, uh, we can do so. But, um, <laughs> well, uh, yeah, indeed, uh, thirteen percent don't exist. I don't. I definitely don't have eight of them on my main account and two of them on my alt account, which I. Uh, well, on my main account, I've very hard farmed for them on legendary summit, uh, especially. But, uh, Last thing we need is an RC bomb in a nuclear reactor. But yeah, they are—they uh, are, of course. Uh... We need to remove the safeguards and restart the reactor. They aren't real. Protections from elites can't hurt you. As yeah, the team uh, upstairs should go, uh, or the northern team should go, uh, take a hard right, and they will uh, link up with us, and we'll uh, even get the close range buff. Uh, oh, we'll get it last, basically. But we'll get it. Just a half of a second too late. them down quickly. Yeah, we'll be getting the close range buff last. Uh, and we'll be doing uh, containment and admin. But yeah, once we have the close range buff, it... Uh... An agent has disconnected. Oh. Wait. As he crashed out again, it seems. But also, did we? What happened to the other guy? I think was, uh, we're down to seven. We were down to seven already. But I did not actually notice what happened to the other one. Because that was our whoever joined us, right? Yeah. No, indeed, no, that was indeed the random one. Didn't catch what happened to them, if they just left or... Well, oh, they're not coming to stab me, they're going, coming to, going to cover and... Oh, come on. <laughs> that's surprising that they got it out. I was headshotting them pretty hard. As yeah, with the close range debuff, because yeah, before it's a buff, it's a debuff. Uh, we uh, we take a lot, uh, like we do a lot less damage in close range. 
Uh, I saw a bunch of people going and getting it, so I will assume they are getting it, which they did, and then we'll go into here. That uh, sucks uh, indeed, then, Essie. And, uh, <laughs> yeah, I cannot completely understand taking that as a sign then. But, uh, yeah, uh, enjoy your lunch, and uh, maybe, uh, maybe till the next ones. I'm gonna go down here, most likely, unless I have shock rounds. Rogue sniper turret yeah, sure. detected. Oh, okay. Hostile sniper turret detected. Oh. I was about to say, that was likely not one of my allies. Rogue assault turret detected. As yeah, we're down to six players. Um, likely this part is still going to be. Oh no, we came in pretty Rogue late. Into striker it. Drone detected. So this will be scaled to six as well. Yeah, so we still need to capture this one, especially. My shooting wasn't great there, but we got there. Uh, and yeah, we're going to uh, admin. Yeah, admin. Oh, which is the main, actually, reactor, right? Uh, set outside of counter or oh for them yeah they might have not loaded incorrectly then they might have crashed out when it uh, when it says that or they might have just left because when you leave it says that for uh, like a second order five and then and then you leave the counter uh and uh Hey there, uh, Shaped Cobra. I am currently using um, just a standard uh, Elmo Obliterate Striker, uh, which is uh, currently the meta kind of thing. If you're uh, if you're interested in it fully, uh, if you go into my build collection, which is a link down below, uh, click the banner of the build collection. Or well, basically, it's, it's this build, but you can. Find all of the stats uh, of it uh, as well down there. Um, there's actually a folder with recommended uh, strikers at the top of it. And uh, in there you will find uh, this one as the number one one. So that's the easiest way of uh, finding its exact stats and stuff. I'll uh, rack this one. That's why I should let me... Just for me to check as well if these still work, because I'm gonna assume they do. Oh, that's that's not that that's not exclamation. That's not an exclamation point. That's an exclamation. There we go. <laughs> that's the link to the to the to the build collection where you can. Uh, yeah, the the striker folder is in there. Right? Critical systems exposed. Okay, this very much is. Uh, the general way of setting up strikers, it works uh, well in all ways uh, for almost anything. Does a lot of damage, but isn't the highest damage version because that one is. Wait, where is this enemy then? Oh, there. Luckily, that goes through his walls, so I know. Area secure. As I, with the close range buff, everything's dying so fast that. <laughs> It's hard to even get shots on target. Uh, I don't feel I've got the uh, chest yet. It's not that one. It's not that one, so it has to be all the way back there. And it is. And yeah, we're heading off to reactor.
Agent, you've reached the reactor. I need you to get it back online. Now that you're in, we need to decrypt the safety protocols. And yeah, our extraction is going to be uh, east as well, so it's pretty close. Although, of course, yeah, reactor is the nice thing about reactor is it's in the middle. <laughs> so it's uh, kind of close to all of them. Like especially the northern one is like right outside. Uh, of course, I'd like going this way. And uh, yeah, I'm going to go for the objective. All of the enemies kind of ran away from here as well, so that's good for me. It will let me get this. Oh, yeah, that kind of worked out going out the way that I did from the other <laughs> other one because yeah, it put me uh, close to here. It wasn't intended, but I'll just say that it was. They're downstairs, they're not upstairs. And yeah, I'm very much stuck in here. And yeah, in a second, that button over there will become active. I'll make my way to it, but maybe likely this someone else will already hit it. To get the reactor back online. Nice. Almost up. I need you to destroy whatever the hell that thing is called. You'll need to run the sequence twice. Mm, I don't actually know why I went this way. I think we just gone for the next button. Is it that reactor is shootable from a, a lot of places? Um, doesn't need to be from here. Iris target approaching. So I'll go objective hunting. We still have plenty of time, but. Might as well get it done. Great work, Agent. Now you just need to restart the reactor and keep any hostiles from knocking it offline or killing you. No pressure. Proceed immediately to your nearest exit. Full lockdown imminent. Iris target approaching. Agent. Casually hitting uh, 2.5 million on a on a headshot. When you're ready to come, <laughs> shoot off a flare. But of course, that's that's only the close range buff, really. That's that's this build is strong, but it isn't that strong. Not at not not at 850 RPM. Not with a not with Alma. Like you can, of course, reach those numbers even like solo, even with uh, like a Kingbreaker or something, but. And yeah, grabbing the loot's gonna go for the big chest, grab that one as well. Off to the extraction. Yeah, with six of us here, it's gonna scale to six, which is a good thing because yeah, otherwise it would be way too hard. Nobody's here, I feel. Let's, uh, let's head on in. And yeah, trigger point is when we reach the bridge here. Oh, they spawn differently. Okay, for uh, for this. Get on that helo. You've got hunters incoming. Oh. 
System restored. Is it? They would spawn there if we're coming from uh, like admin or from uh, other places. I'm gonna push up on the right side here. When you're ready, send up a flare so Torres can pick you up. System reactivated. I'm gonna guess uh, Salty's uh, PFE there, just from uh, <laughs> the ability to survive against uh, standing in front of. Uh, a hunter. Is it? We're, we're having a chopper coming in a second. Most likely. Oh, we have one hunter in the back as well. Watch out for that one. I need to watch out. I've already hit my health gate. Next down is going to just take me down. Thank you for the heals. Oh, is it? That last hunter's over there. Oh, two of them. And down they go. I'm gonna do some killing first and then uh, uh, closer. <laughs> Not the closer I am looking for. These are not the closers you're looking for. These aren't the closers we're looking for. Move along, move along. Yeah. Uh, at least a little bit too short. <laughs> I was about to go look and see like what's what's the time left as <laughs> as yeah. of course gonna be uh this upgrade to your YouTube channel. I've been looking for a build to do heroic pandan, so thanks very much for sharing with me. Yeah, well, you're welcome man and uh, thanks for the subscription and uh, yeah especially um for heroic countdowns, uh, yeah, uh, there are several good standards, but you can never go wrong with a uh, with, uh, with, with the obliterate striker. They are the main damage dealers uh, for for heroic strike uh, for count heroic countdowns as well. There are other builds that work well as well, um, like EFE, like uh, Hazard Protected uh, Eclipses, uh, buffing builds. Keep working to but uh, yeah, the, keep just being a good damage dealer is, is a good starting point. So I should kind of maybe make a countdown folder as well. As some people have uh, already suggested and asked <laughs> for. Uh, just like builds for countdown and uh... entering safe area. <laughs> but like yeah, the skill builds work too. Uh, uh, I mean, depends depends on how you define skill builds. Uh, is is eclipse a skill build? It's a build that uses skills. Is a hazard protected eclipse. <laughs> Actually, for uh, this next run, I'm gonna swap on over. As, uh, as, yeah, as I was talking about PFEing, I'm gonna I'm gonna grab my PFE as well. Yeah. Um, and yeah, we'll start up an not another. Another agent. Oh, it resets me to group. that. <laughs> yeah. We'll start setting up another heroic. Uh, And I'll uh, invite in a uh, current party. I'm going to guess that, yeah, I see uh, uh, had their fill. Uh, after, okay. And yeah, Salty is sitting one out. So it's uh, five of us now. But yeah, if anybody's interested in uh, joining us, uh, feel free to say so as I briefly just uh, open a few caches and give you guys some time. If you are interested in joining us, 
and you know, just recruiting people out of chats, just you know, instead of matchmaking as much as possible. Nice you, matchmaking the rest, basically. I appreciate the trade. Mm. Oh, okay, Spin. Oh, yeah, and uh, you were the PFE, right? So, uh, not the only PFE. Um, yeah, I'll uh, start the matchmaker. We'll uh, fill it up. And yeah, there, there's uh, going to be a bunch more likely. Uh, Another agent is. I'll likely do uh, three, uh, maybe four more of these and just run the evening through with some, uh, with some uh, countdowning. <laughs> Hopefully, getting closer to some closers. Setting up for some setups as I uh, massage my legs into not being asleep <laughs> as I've uh, had uh, did sit uh, quite a while today. As, uh, Omni's on a striker. He was on a striker as well, I think. Uh, yeah. Another agent has joined your group. Uh, An agent has left your group. And so that was a striker as well. And yeah, we'll just give these guys a peek. Um, that's a weird build, but for sure, fine. I mean, it's not the worst choice, but if you're going companion here anyway, why not go double companion at that? Another agent is now in your group. And <laughs> even more companions. But yeah, that's fine. They're strong enough for, uh, for, for our doings. And uh, yeah, we might get a crit headshot closer. Yeah, getting the the double reds is uh, already hard enough. <laughs> and then, uh, in my case, I specifically need it to be a uh, chance and damage for. Uh, for yeah, that, uh, I'll get one eventually. I've gotten most of the other setups and stuff that I uh, need. So this thing has become uh, very much my white whale. But, uh, we. Uh, We'll, we'll just keep going. And, uh, I, I've done worse farms. I've farmed for uh, for like golden chest with haste and status effect and glass on it already to record and stuff. That was about as bad as a farm as this one. Reactor unstable. Emergency lockdown protocols activated. Fifteen minutes to lockdown. Excessive power detected. Increased okay, so reactor admin in a second. Both teams are linking up nicely. I'll, I'll grab this. But I shouldn't have actually, I should have pushed in. Because, uh, yeah, no close range buff, but also no status effects getting in our way. Directive wise, at least. I'll push into here, I guess. Very useful here. In, uh, keeping them out of cover and stuff. System back online. Yeah, with Elmo's around, it's actually been uh, quite noticeable how few uh, Scorpios are nowadays uh, being used. That's it. Reactor, and then uh, an admin, and then we'll come back for Turbine. We 
But yeah, because of course, only one exotic gets to be equipped, so... A lot of people are equipping Elmos, and uh, that means that uh, very few people are still have a, <laughs> a Scorpio equipped on, on red builds. Making uh, a lot of those fights a lot more... Like, like the Hunter fights have actually gotten harder than easier uh, lately. Just because of that. Everybody went their own way up there. And yeah, I pushed up here just in case nobody was going up there. But uh, I was already like expecting people to be up there, so that was fine. And and there were, and they got it quickly. So uh, I didn't check for the chest because it's, it is a, yeah, it is on top of the balcony. Because yeah, that's the other thing I went up there for, of course, yes. <laughs> you must know where the loot is. Yeah, the nice thing about PFE is, of course, you're protected from all elites, mostly. But also, yeah, you, you deal a lot less damage, so... To actually make it work well, you kind of have to... Not just played as a red build. You kind of have to actually go for objectives and stuff. Area secure. Should have actually left that special ammo. Some special ammo. Out of it, so. Not the biggest loss. But yeah, I was uh, playing a few countdowns, I think it was this afternoon, kind of thing, and uh, yeah, it was, uh, I ran into several people running PFE builds and playing them as if they are uh, land rats, or like strikers. You're in. And that's not really, like, the way they should be played. You really need to play aggressively with them, put yourself in, in the line of fire, because otherwise you might as well have been just a high-end red or a striker. Now, this one is eliminate, so... Chest is underneath the balcony. So yeah, here there's no objective for me to like push towards and uh, quickly get. But what I'll do instead is just go and run and uh, aggro as much stuff as I can and just be in their face. And the more of them are shooting me, the less they are shooting my allies. Yeah. Kind of how you kind of have to play them. Hostile detected. Yeah, one thing I should do is use my shield more, but I should try to not block my allies. We got a named, but it's not even from targeted. Yeah, the TKB does not really have uh, a really good accuracy, really. Agent, you should be able to access the turbine now. Yeah, we can take the back route to turbine, which is uh, 
nice and fast. I will put us by the objective right away as well. Well, the first subject. Yeah, you're looking uh, for a setup there then. Yeah, if I run into any setups, uh, because I, I've already had my... Uh, the setup I do have in perchance crit damage variants already. The only variant I still need. One more of is um, a repair skill, skill damage for uh, half healer, but that one is a uh, low priority. That build already doesn't find much use anyway. <laughs> it's it's a legacy build at this point. Over to the new grid. And get this thing right away. And having messed around with this build, still a lot more. Um, I'm still not sold on it anyway. So, this is the build actually that will uh, also get that closer. It's uh, part of it. Let's see how I'm going for it. So I'll let him get it. No, is it that one? I remember it was the one on the right, but I was at the wrong one. <laughs> Somebody uh, instantly got the button. So I'll uh, hit this once again, and it's going to be back there. And yeah, this is the next one, so I'll just stay and wait here because yeah, see, I'm only going for it. And get that one. And I see Palmer going for that one, so I'll start moving for the button. You're good to go. Just need to switch. This yeah, this one, especially if the team is uh, set up correctly for it <laughs> and uh, knows their knows where it's going to be, uh, it can go really fast. And yeah, I'll I'll stay in this. Uh, I'll stay in here. And yeah, as I'm staying in here, I'll uh, turn on an emote and just uh, keep the legs moving. Keep the body moving, keep the music grooving. And uh, I see a name Chevron there. And uh, I'll just sit here and salivate and hope that that is a, that that is a closer. <laughs> this very much feels like dancing on top of, uh, on top of <laughs> mailboxes in, <laughs> in, uh, in WoW or something. As it, I'm gonna go loot first. Because, uh, of course I am. My team has it. We'll get there eventually. Crit chance, crit damage, but... Uh, well, uh, crit chance has a protection on that one. So it can become crit chance, crit damage, but not with the red core, which is what I'm after. I was about to say, where's this last? Enemy. Good work, Agent. You saved the plant. Move to extraction point. Is that friendly? I did get up. Well, I did get up actually pretty early today, right? Yeah. To go. Is yeah, annoyingly for the next few days as well, I'll be getting up at six in the morning, which is. Uh, Usually, like, five hours after the stream. No that guy is in a hurry. Uh, yeah, there's enough of us here. We can push in. But yeah, he could have very easily died. And yeah, this very much is the time for... Uh, System ...the Kefis to shine, which is to lead the charge, push into enemies, did that one hunter fall back? I see two hunters on the right. I'm gonna go play with them. Now, playing with hunters is very dangerous. It's like playing with tigers. Airburst, 
But yeah, you kind of have to know how far you can stick your hand into them or like near them before they bite, especially. There were three of them. The fourth one made it back there, like me. Shoot out the flares. The Taurus knows you're ready to go. System back online. Where? Uh, <laughs> that's where he went. Just let it happen. And yeah, there we did a pretty clean clean. I feel that's kind of like the strength. Of the, uh, it's noticeable. Like, yeah, the, there is a lack of damage on them on PFEs, but. It is always, to me, noticeable, especially if sometimes other players as well are like good players on, on PFEs. Hilo inbound. Uh, wait, didn't we have like a ton of time left there? I feel we have still like a minute left or something, <laughs> or was it already time? Extraction. Mm. We'll be cutting it close. Actually, this is like dangerously close because they're coming out at like twenty. Oh uh, yeah, I think it's maybe better to just egress. Yeah, 11, 10, 9. Okay, I'm just grabbing loot and going. Oh, yeah, that, that guy likely will not extract because yeah, he was way far behind still <laughs> when I looked over my shoulder there. I'm impressed. Which uh, sure yeah, he's still active, time. which yeah. Sucks for him. Yes, that chopper uh, was uh, way late. Safe area entered. Uh, good to hear, uh, Spoon. Yeah, I'll uh, get you an invite in a second. Um, I don't know if anybody wants this closer with crit chance, which you can do crit chance, crit damage, and you will have to keep the blue core. But yeah, if you want, if you want it, say so, and I'll. Uh, I'll share it. Thanks for the business. So deconstruct rest. That one was not marked for deconstruction. Another agent has joined your group. Agent. Good no. to be seeing you. No, hang on. I shall hang on to that one for now. Um do one one umbra to expertise. Oh. Yeah, that one just run as long as it's like not super bad builds. You can run whatever kind of takes your fancy. Yeah, feel free to like experiment. Like in here, we're with teammates that are like will be making good teams anyway. Uh, like, you have left the group. Good enough on damage Another and good enough on uh, in your group. on. Uh, On capabilities that like agent has joined your group. And Umbra isn't a bad setup actually having having It's actually one of the ones uh, I'm kinda hovering between is now in your group. a few builds for the next build showcase. It might be Umbra as well, but I think not. I think I'll keep that one for uh for in the new season. 
Mostly because it, it is actually a good build. I want to go with a silly build for the next one. Well, not silly, but like an and like off-brand build. <laughs> like Red EP or that or that Headhunter Sniper build or uh, or stuff like that. Uh, I'll be running uh, PFE once more. Uh, I'll just uh, start matchmaking already. Uh, I didn't miss anyone, right? Is it, uh, yeah. Is it, I see, yeah. Uh, it's busy and, yeah. Uh, uh, can't have many. Find more agents. As we fill up the last two spots with uh, some randoms. Another agent has joined your group. These weapons are weird. Like, Another together with this SHG level is the weird part of us. It's also everything's expertise and stuff. I mean, yeah, I'm not going to kick him, but... Uh, is it at least foam? Okay, it is at least foam. Uh, we didn't have anybody foaming, right? Yeah, no. Uh, we on uh, ready P or uh, red um, uh, FI uh, mode. Oh, but well, it's fine. They can they can foam the hunters. We have enough damage on that team as well. We can deal with them anyway. I shall have a peek at actually then updated there. <laughs> it's gonna have a look at uh, how uh, the Umbra was set up on Muddy, but hadn't updated. So. Uh, we shall have no ideas. Communication relay offline. <laughs> Coyotes. Well. The true sons have triggered a lockdown at the plant. Oh, we have a failed start, which is good for us. It, it'll put both teams here. If they control the power... But yeah, we should uh, wait for the other team once we get by this gate. Although this part is timed, so we it's, need to it's remove a the matter for us. And restore comms. But yeah, especially we need to kind of... Ah, yeah, they're all loaded in. System curtailed. As a, usually, Team 1 loads in faster than Team 2. And what we especially want to avoid is uh, killing the hunter before the other team has actually... Like, actually loaded in or outdistance them far enough that they don't get the loot from it but they were there system restored yeah this is always also annoying because uh, now we don't know what extraction is although well it doesn't really matter <laughs> but, uh, but i like always deducing where the where the extraction is i'm gonna leave that to others because i'm i'm valuable here to system uh, go and CC this guy with some uh, with some of this. <laughs> Does that guy tried to? Uh, Saved by my shock there from the Scorpio. As uh, that hatchet was coming towards my face. <laughs> Where was that foam aimed at? <laughs> I was about to like kind of go like that guy is uh, not really showing his prowess with the foam. Uh, so yeah, containment, turbine, both are good. Uh, yeah, let's go containment and then turbine. Uh, I mean, well, nah, they, they'll just follow. Let's check the whole container. <laughs> You're closing in on the target. Mostly we want to do containment first because, yeah, then it's in a line uh, going, the, going the other way. You're not going yeah, fighting with some true sons. 
and I lost where my target was there. <laughs> so I started shooting an ally. How many shots does she need before she that thing explodes on her <laughs> belt? And the answer is many bits. We're on heroic countdown with eight eight man scaling and enemies are chonky. They be chonky. And yeah, there we have my arch nemesis purples. As I am of course PFE. And I'm not protected from them, which is very dangerous. Eight of us are here as well. Just double checking. Surprised I actually haven't gotten anything worth keeping. Is quite often you still like get you know non-targeted stuff that is kind of worth keeping. <clears throat> kind of rebuilding my LMG library as a. Uh, I'm gonna. Redo all of them to become uh, rate of fire ones. As yeah, crit chance ones don't have, really have a purpose for me anymore. Uh, sir, could you walk over there and be shot by all my friends? That'll be that'll be very nice. So I'll just, I'll just keep him busy, and then eventually team will roll around and murderize him. <laughs> High value target neutralized. Uh, that 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 was funny. High risk uh, that was, as as the team suddenly came around the corner, I was as I was fighting that guy for like like a whole minute there, uh, and then like all eight of them, I kind of I kind of want to go back and uh, and and get the screenshot of that. As they also everybody came around the corner at the same time. That was that was actually kind of funny. <laughs> Area secure. Okay. Turbine next. Admin is last, so from we can take the north exit from turbine in the end as well. Just uh, and uh, ten minutes to lock down. Evacuate the facility. Make it the shortest route, basically. Shut down. Uh, let me catch up here. <laughs> I'm gonna run a grey build. I'm gonna take Pomic's uh, lead there and uh, indeed uh, take the secret route in. Uh, there's this way into here which... Uh, doesn't get highlighted by Isaac really uh, until you're in it usually. Uh, I'll go for the back one. See people going for the front one. So. Yeah, I'm gonna just go touch first and then uh, turn around and fight. Not the weapon I thought I had in my hands. So. Confused there for a second why not a continuous stream came out. Mm. It's shootable from here, I shrink. Data transfer halted. Incoming. High-risk hostile. Hmm. Picked the wrong way there. Okay. Area secure. Agent, head to the administration building. I feel I didn't get the chest there yet. 
but it's up on the balcony, so. And yeah, we can uh, take the back route to... Admin. Where we'll uh, do our favorite... Favorite job, or whatever <laughs> Kelso's line is. <laughs> well, uh, it's uh, not not hard to use Umbra. It's basically get in cover, fire a little bit. Once that bar is full, get out of cover and fire even more. I'm going to line it up and the game should give it to me. Come on, give it to me. There we go. Slime. <laughs> That's it. But, uh... That is still my favorite animation of the game. Agent, you've reached Sliding the overhead. Building. I need you to fix the comms. Mm. And yeah, here I might be pushing in solo, but I'm also on a PFE, and that is a build that can do that as well. So I'm gonna just uh, head on in and try to uh, go as fast for the objective. You can't? Okay, you can't climb up. I was curious about that actually, if you could climb up there, but it turns out you can't. <laughs> I'm just gonna run through everyone. The chest is in the office, but I'm actually going to go for the objective. I'll be a good boy. Warning. System breach. Initiating safety protocol. Once again, we are uh, stuck in a moment of zen in all of this craziness with all of these alarms. We are just stuck here waiting our time, biding our time. We have interacted with uh, control room servers, and yeah, there's nothing for us to shoot here. So we shall just find our center, become one with everything, one with reality. <laughs> uh, we shall nice find our inner uh, chameleon, and then we shall uh, murder. Everything. Everything. Both of the other servers are being gotten. Uh, I'm actually gonna, yeah, I'm gonna help kill here. I'm just gonna hang around here for in a second because yeah, the next round will also include the control server. Uh, this, this, uh, this one. So. I'll hang around here and interact with that once it comes out. Which will be now. Whoever said tech support was boring. One more server and you can reboot the system. Warning. System breach. Initiating safety protocol. Or are you saying it for? High risk hostile. Because <laughs> then I'll go looting. And then I'll go hit the launch server if nobody else does, but somebody else has gotten it already. Is that that chest is in the offices? We keep, we are at least getting closers with reds. So that's that's already more than I've gotten uh, recently. <laughs> System rebooted. Communications. Eventually, one day, the search will end. My life will become empty. As we'll put that one into a build and <laughs> and and then the search is done what's left to do then and yeah the answer is uh, by that point likely uh, the new descent will be out and uh, then farming uh, infinite amount well not infinite amounts but 
many amounts of uh of uh agent you saved the plant move to extraction point uh, blueprints from reconstructed caches to bring you home that way where's extraction it is north okay so pretty close as well But yeah, we should bunch up once more. Let's the hunters spawn a little bit outside here. All right, seven of us here, let's... Uh... Start to uh, start to go in. Oh, <laughs> actually, Tomic was already over there. Okay. Detected. It's actually not a bad idea to exit through here, through there, and put yourself up there. Although did that spawn one of the hunters down there? Oh, okay. okay. The black dusk have moved pretty far out. Mm, I think we have three hunters so far, so there's likely still one, I think. the full debuff on him. Convinced that my team would have that. Turn. I just pushed into the big pile of black dust that were behind it. Sure, I didn't leave any loot behind. So. I have the special ammo, might as well. I'm do some barbecuing, even though the weather has gone a little bit colder. <laughs> Finally, I, I kind of had it with the heat, it's luckily become uh, much cooler, although suddenly as well, uh, a lot cooler. Yeah, that, that basically is indeed uh, the play <laughs> for Umbra, as, uh, as uh, snakes put out there. It's, uh, yeah, get in cover, get out of cover, and then the gun goes brrrr. But yeah, Umbra is actually a pretty good build. I feel a lot of people go... I mean, the thing is, nothing competes with Strikers, is, is kind of the issue. Torres is in position. Um, but it does compete well enough with a lot of the other choices. I have enough time to uh, kill this one. But yeah. 
Off we go. Signal our extraction. <laughs> Oh, and uh, he got toasty. The entire region owes you a debt of gratitude that they can never repay. Thank you. Uh, I'm, I'm good on those, uh, Spearn, but yeah, maybe if, uh, indeed, if anybody needs a bee or a liberty, I'm going to guess uh, Spearn got a boat. As a <laughs> oh, yeah, the, they did say that they uh, had... Uh, Safe area detected. They were looking for a pistol, so they likely had pistol as their target, so they likely picked some of those up. So no keepers on my end. Oh. You can strike that one as well. Yeah, I'll uh, set up another one. And yeah, likely we'll do uh, two more. Maybe a third more, of course, because that's that's not uncommon for me to uh, <laughs> go one more and then go one more and then one more after the one more. Another agent has joined your group. Oh, as a pomic crash out. Okay, I was wondering as I saw you come back online. So I guess that uh, yeah, something had gone wrong there. And if you can wait one, yeah, well, well, we can uh, give you a minute. I'm gonna guess, uh... Ah, okay. <laughs> Looking for something? Yeah, so while we're Thanks. waiting to, uh... We're probably to get a little back up and, uh... And Toasty needs a minute to join as well. And Omni needs a second as well. <laughs> We're waiting for those. <laughs> that is that is an item to get, but yeah, not an item to keep. You can strike that. Hello there. And then, yeah. Once we're all in, we'll uh, head in once more. Once more into that breach of uh, trying to find Yuzina pieces. I should likely be full up on Yuzina brand things, right? I'm going to guess. Uh, yeah. <laughs> I mean, actually, I'm, I'm, I'm full up on most brands. There's a, because yeah, I usually don't like, there's a lot of craft brands that I don't craft for and yeah, you fill up eventually, especially if you're sharing. <laughs> but yeah, I, I would have found it amusing if my Yuzinas weren't uh, completed. So, uh, test these online. Uh, I will give Omni and Palmic a second. Another agent is now in your group. Only appears to be online. I'll send the invite their way. Taking the Elmo from level 18 to 23 hertz. Yeah. I mean, that's 60 plus even more, right? But yeah, to me, the Elmo isn't the gun I will be taking to 20, like into the high. Box online as well. Um, Another 
right. like for me, only the famas really it will go up that high. Uh, do we have everybody that wants to be in? I believe so, right? Uh, we are missing. We had seven before, right? Ah, oh, that was the the buddy of uh, Omni. Uh, I'm gonna guess they uh, they had their fill and <laughs> have moved on. Um, I'm missing anybody else. Well, I mean, likely not, but yeah, it would be people from the friends list. So. But yeah, if anybody else is also interested uh, to join us, feel free to say so. If, uh, we can uh, add you to the list and uh, get you in. Uh, although I'll start matchmaking and yeah, we'll be doing one uh, one more likely after this one, so likely for that one. But yeah, this uh, mostly currently is already people from the chat. So. Oh, <laughs> you went to pass that. Yeah. Yeah, I can uh, totally get that. Well, yeah, he... Uh, uh, he did well, and uh, he... Uh, carried his weight, so... So I keep doing that with this water bottle, which is super annoying, which is that you shouldn't actually like lift it up, but just actually just it's a, it has a straw. So you kind of have to just sip the straw. <laughs> I keep doing like, you know, the obvious thing that I always want to do with a water bottle. Yeah. And yeah, you're just supposed to... Uh, Drink it like a drink, uh, like a straw cup. This we're waiting for it to fill up. It's getting later in the evening on a weekdays, and it's mostly gonna be trying to pull people from the from the uh, Europe servers, and uh, that's getting late. Yeah. As yeah. The, the screen says they have 5k uh, Canton coins saved up. I uh, I as well have uh, <laughs> 7k <laughs> saved up at this point. Yeah, how many? So it's 2.2244 uh, each or 10 exotic ashes. So yeah, I have enough for 30 almost. Almost. As I, usually, I don't save them up. I usually just spend them as they come in. Uh, this is taking abnormally long, I feel. Might actually... Uh, uh, yeah. Just to try... Gonna cancel Matchmaker and restart Matchmaker. So I feel that... that that was taking too long for just two people on a heroic. Oh yeah, and the field recon and the SH. Well, at least those are like, well, in your case as well. Uh, <laughs> uh, 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 watch altable, so that that makes those at least a little bit more uh, more doable. And yeah, at one point as well in the start, because I was kind of waiting for uh, for items to uh, to like kind of get a feel of like what I should be spending it on named items, or or I got up to like thirteen or fourteen k before I started spending them. But yeah, more recently I've been, which I. Is he maybe on a... This is just not good enough for Heroic Canton. Like, this guy should not be matchmaking for Heroic Canton. So... I will uh, regret to inform him that he has been... Uh, his services are not required. Like, if he was, like, 200k or uh, 200k, 200... <laughs> Uh, 200 SHD or something, I would have hyped out of like, hey dude, 
you need a better build, but at that level, like another agent is now in your group. just do better builds than that. Because this is also like a bad build, but that was fine. Like it has it has some damage. Uh and that one's not bad at all, although Eagle Bearer is a is a weird thing to take into account. Huh? <laughs> I mean, well, oh, what their names actually? I didn't even uh, check. It, but, but yeah, bunch of uh, health rolls and stuff, and just like, nah, nah. Communication relay. <laughs> well, that's. Uh... <laughs> well, I mean, 200k SHD and that build, I would still kick them. I would kick them even harder. At 200k SHD, you would... Well, first off, I would assume they were not legitimate, first of all, and secondly, also a horrible build. Uh, yeah, we're taking a right. Unstable. Emergency lockdown protocols activated. 15 minutes. Please proceed to your nearest exit. Lockdown safety protocols initiated. I don't even actually know what I what why I went with like KSHD because like I wanted to say like 200 SHD, but I think I went with like 200k or, or, or I don't even actually remember how it went. Is it we have a status effect? Oh, okay, we have the status effects are back now. As it, that was the first directive we got to hit, luckily, so that helps a lot. Oh, was that what he had on? Okay. Yeah, then then likely what he was trying to do was trying to... Uh, to um, get... Uh, proficiency. Um, yeah, that, that's some amount of body blocking going there. <laughs> System reactivated. System curtailed. Let's see what uh, there we're doing turbine cooling tower. Well, let's go do cooling tower first, then I think. System restored. Uh, or well, everybody came back. <laughs> just go to turbine. Let's just go turbine. It was most of the team was over there, but then everybody came out. <laughs> Rogue striker drone detected. Hostile striker drone detected. So that is what happens when uh, you put me in charge. Well, I, nobody put me in charge. I, I just took charge. But, <laughs> but yeah, I, especially when I'm sleepy. Indecision sets in. Actually, this one's maxed out. Target approaching. I'll spawn here. None of the pellets hit. This guy is. This guy is a hedgehog. Who's that?
writing that uh, the puppies we picked up are uh, most of the times under under 1k. They end up being. You're in. We need to locate the target. I've been noticing a lot of people giving bad advice uh, to new players of just, oh, just go match make heroic countdowns, which, yeah, new players shouldn't be. Protect the engineer. Ten minutes to lock down. Wait, why did protect the engineer play? I mean, the, the answer is uh, one of those two randoms went over there, most likely. If you're an admin, you have some form of brain damage. <laughs> I don't disagree with him. JK, I love you. But yeah. Hammer on top as well. High value target. Name spawn there as well. <laughs> Come on now. Come out, sleepy. Okay. Uh, you're a little loud. Just making sure that I don't accidentally scroll over kick because I just want to mute him. I don't want to kick him. But yeah, also, I'm willing to bet, actually. Oh no, it's still you. But he likely got pulled out of uh, US East. <laughs> As well. One thing that uh, I've always noticed, uh, having played quite late, uh, usually uh, in a lot of games, is uh, how much more vocal uh, American players are over European players. Partially as well as just that they're used to that like that everybody that they're usually in a server with is sharing in the same language which <laughs> especially on europe you get used to it that yeah sometimes you could be like yelling at people and wanting to communicate how angry you are but yeah they're just like they won't get it because they are not uh uh you know they don't understand that language. <laughs> oh, Toasty's getting uh, setups. Oh, yeah, I need uh, two setups in uh, in uh, quick succession. Flag is still cool looking like that. Agent, you've reached the reactor. I need you to get it back online. Wait, is that guy still an admin? The admin did the things not die? I got nice coming now over. That you're in, we need to decrypt the safety protocols. Actually, the, the, the yeah, the VIP must have died because uh, the objective isn't there. Oh. I see people going for that part. I'll, I'll let them do that. I'll go check up here for the chest. It's not on the balcony. 
And I'll go hang out by where the button's gonna be in a second. Although Toasty's doing the same, I think. Sure, what I'll do is uh, go for the next button. Set myself up as well in a place where I can shoot the first generator. Warning, reactor unstable. Nice, almost done. I need you to destroy whatever the hell that thing is called. You'll need to run the sequence twice. Good work decrypting the protocols. Yes. You need to remove those controls to get the reactor back on. Yes, we are min maxing our productivity there. Evacuate the facility. Five minutes to lock down. Great work, Agent. Now you just need to restart the reactor and keep any hostiles from knocking it offline or killing you. No pressure. Iris target approaching. Iris target approaching. Where did the name give them so little bonus health? Like they have a tiny amount, <laughs> they had like a tiny amount of like ragers going on. Good work, agent. You saved the plant. But that could have direction. only come really from the names. When you're ready to come home, shoot off a flare. Yeah, I'm gonna go get the big chest and then uh, egress. Loot get up there. <laughs> I mean, somebody climbed up here and died. That's that's the actual answer. But yeah, it looked weird. System. Somebody already went and spawned the hunters, which is likely again not one of our two puppies. Detected. An agent has gone offline. Well, Testy crashed out sadly. And uh, the, the puppy activated. died, will die. There's nobody there to save him. Agent down. Neutralize that hunter. And that, that is uh, why you don't solo into into hunters, uh, especially when you don't have a build. And yeah, we have to watch out a little bit because we'll be at eight-man scaling here. Um, but uh, we lost uh, three people in total. So we also lost uh, Muddy as well, Toasty and Muddy. Okay, the annoying thing is that that guy spawned them in before both of them fully crashed out, meaning that this will all be 8 mats oh, That explosion was uh, really not what I wanted. Did I get a heal? Yeah. Dunders is pushing up that left side actually. Uh, I'm just gonna go. Oh, one's behind us. <laughs> System reactivated. Now push in. See healing box screen. We have a minute. Use another med pack and then use that to push in. Oh, 
That means that there's still a hunter up. Let's deal with him. This last hunter. Fuck you. Hey, I especially don't want that healing box going down. Uh, sir, please stop minigunning. Got nice and messy. As, uh, yeah, we just need to egress. Uh, make sure to grab all of your loots. And, uh, as yeah, we need to go. <laughs> Off we go. Nice work. You stabilized the power grid in this region. An agent has left your group. An agent is back online. Mm, but yeah, we still got full um, points. Yeah, we did lose two people, sadly. Mm, and yeah, indeed, uh, Madian and Thirsty crashed out. Which, uh, sadly, still... The countdown is still the one place where... Safe area entered. It's still the most unstable place of the game. Let's hey, say hey. it that way. But we uh, did get to recover it a little bit. We didn't lose anybody on extraction or such, so that's that's good. Why doesn't use anybody use intimidate with heartbreakers? Because the chest of heartbreakers uh, better than intimidate overall. Uh, the peak of intimidate is going to be higher, but the chest of uh, heartbreaker is already like, going to be so much easier to get that all in. As yeah, well, I'll uh, do one more uh, downtown, um, which will definitely be my last one as I'm <laughs> getting more and more tired and uh, finding it difficult to uh, be coherent as I'm giving people 200k SHDs and stuff. Uh, and yeah, we'll be doing an heroic one. Uh, I press and hold because I'm not away with the group. Um, yeah, I'll uh, reinvite everybody back in. in your group. Um. <laughs> well, this will definitely be my last one as I'm uh, feeling uh, quite drowsy. Yeah. And you know what? Uh, I'll go back as well to. Uh, Something different, I, I think. I can just go glass. Glass always works. I think I'll just grab strikers as well. Yeah, let's just go full strikers. And yeah, we'll make it an obliterate one just for 
ease of use, not having to stack excessively. Mm -hmm. uh, did I miss anybody, by the way? Because, yeah, uh, Omni was in as well, but I don't think uh, shows us in mission. Mm, you just want to know. <laughs> On my group, like, uh, I just have to build, so I, I think, some PFEs. I think I put some PFEs together. And what after that? Any recommendations? Well, um, I mean, depends kind of what you have already. Like, PFE, I think, is very useful for... Uh, uh, oh, that only is uh, loaded in, I think. Did that go through? That did go through. But yeah, it kind of depends on yeah, what you have already. PFEs I very much enjoy for countdown and stuff. Uh, rogues as well, in groups even as well. Like, PFE is one of those builds that I make sure to that like each of my characters is now in your group. He has one of them because just. But yeah, it kind of really depends on on. Um, I must start with it. Uh, I need to do this. Um, what you already have. Another agent has joined your group. Hmm. I might. Uh, uh, I'm going to tell that guy. Uh, challenging. Yeah, I'm done. That that contains a bunch of spelling errors, but uh, but yeah, he will. Uh, and I'll give him a second, and then just. <laughs> giving him a second to uh, read it, but uh, but yeah, uh, they're much better off on challenging as well, like just for themselves as well. Uh, let's see. Uh, <laughs> Two piece foundry. Uh, Red Fire Striker, CC Fire, Oxy, and Regulus. I've got it right here. Yeah, the uh, Hunter's Fury SMG. Uh, well, I, I'd put it. Well, if, it, if it's mostly for group play, that one, as you say, there, yeah. I would say, it's like, well, a tech tank, but then maybe not for a group play character. Um, ongoing directive is an obvious one uh, to have as well, uh, especially with Redify, because then when you want to play support build, but then there's already an FI, then you can swap to OD. Um, and ODs are good as well. Mm. And, uh, yeah, but, uh, Trying to think what else is like I mean true Patri red patriot is also an option but red patriot isn't really useful outside of really set uh, I'm gonna do this again to the match maker just just in case because last time that helped let's see if it helps again by restarting it although maybe yeah there's a very few maybe people <laughs> matchmaking for her account this evening uh, this late in the evening <laughs> well, yeah, I mean, the ongoing directive is just pretty decent. It's a good enough support build, especially for encounter. So, 
Um, I mean, it's a really good support build. Redify just is better, I think. But I'm going Zerg's ammo and stuff as well for just group play is pretty good. <laughs> I'm going for uh, three PFE builds. Yeah, I mean, uh, the, there are different ones for different purposes. I, I very much like having a high-end one, especially the shotgun one that I have on uh, character 5 is like the recommended one. Uh, and the striker one is very much a great one. But then maybe I would say um, uh, make the third one uh, because maybe put uh, put in a raid tank, maybe, as if it's a group play character. Another agent is uh, now in your group. So have the raid tank and then maybe have a raid tank with it. I don't think I've ever seen anybody use Gila knee pads ever in my life. Because why would... I mean, you usually don't use Gila in here anyway, because 5% total armor is nothing. Um, you would be much better off keeping this being crit damage or something, and then just taking another blue core. You would lose less. But yeah, I don't think I've ever specifically seen anybody use... <laughs> They're in medkit as well, okay. Uh, okay. You guys choose. Uh, kick or stay. I mean, they're hazard protected. That's that's what this setup is, but it's also completely useless. I mean, this is the worst way of doing hazard protection, basically. You're much better off keeping your backpack talent and not doing it with the one piece of this. Like, what? Uh, yeah. An agent I agree. <laughs> well, we don't need damage, but we have plenty of damage, but uh, it's just, yeah, no. If you're 500 or something, maybe then. But Another agent is now in your. Like this, I'm much more fine with. Although this is a Cheska knee pad graded to 23. I don't think. Sure. Sure. Just let's go. <laughs> like with how especially in a build like that uh foxes will be best in slot like there are places where foxes isn't best in slot but that build is specifically a place where foxes will be best in slot. What's going on? A lot of them because I've also was on. I'm to love my PFE. It's for the dogs. Communication relay offline. Uh, if you're taking, uh, if you're thinking of making the PFEs, uh, they're um, I would make the high end and the strikers. The heartbreaker isn't on the same class. I feel <laughs> it. it it not getting to uh, have the pulse laser kind of kind of hurts it way too much. It always feels a little bit awkward where the striker one just feels Reactor like, unstable. like a true build. The heartbreaker one always feels like it's a little bit annoying because you're either having to headshot and then keeping your shield or you're using a scanner pulse and then you don't have a shield. Yeah, it's... Oh, oh yeah, I'm... I am no longer PFE. We did get ours. Might have killed those guys a little bit too fast for the other team to uh, get credit.
Hmm. Admin turbine. Yeah. So let's do turbine first. And then we'll go admin. Right? Yeah. But yeah, we can take the back route later as well. Shade tech detected. Yeah, shouldn't be as gun ho. <laughs> I'm not PFE. Uh, Rogue striker drone detected. God damn it, his head is behind the railing there. about to have a bad day. Oxy. Area secure. <laughs> Four. I'm too curious now. Okay, he always had Oxy on it. He just, he just likes using Oxy on that build. No, why not? It will add... Oh, I didn't get a chest yet, I think. Nice. Yeah, we're heading over to admin next. Yeah, the chest got to be there. Is that in the time that it takes out the oxy and fires it and then starts doing damage and stuff, he had just fired normally. <laughs> And gotten two shots in, he would have done more than that. I see what would do on a red build, well, red with blue, of course. Well, I mean, uh, the, uh, that's a patching open uh, that is using it for the hunters for the engagement. Like, it's just a bad way of doing uh, hazard protection the way he was doing it. Because you are much better off getting that last piece and putting hazard protection on it and. Uh, we're killing. Some more hounds, but uh, not yet. We still need to first make them Im not immune. Yeah, uh, if you just go hazard protection on all pieces instead of the ninja bike you get to have a backpack talent and that backpack talent can give you so much more than than, than you're losing there especially with also one piecing cavalier which also costs you you know brand bonuses and and uh, also another like minor it just if you calculate it out it it's all becomes obvious how give up doing it down <laughs> which was kind of more what irked me about it Area secure. Agent, but also as well he wasn't like what was he gonna do with his hazard protection like, drop his hive when he went down like because he didn't have any skills that were useful there like he could have maybe i don't remember if he had a cam so that maybe he had a foam uh oh no i did get uh i did get the chest But even then, it would have actually been 
hindrance because we already have a bomb. Secure the area so we can bring in the engineer. Wait, what? Protect the engineer. <laughs> oh, I think I had the same idea there of that the main was reactor. I saw Palmer going in there, I think. Oh, but yeah, it's uh, the main is container. Well, we don't get to go take selfies with the VIP, with that influencer. They shall influence no one. And yeah, we're entering containment in the right way as well. I need you to secure the radioactive material. The main objective or the first objective is right here. The funny thing was as well, that guy was uh, actually uh, in kit, which, uh, yeah, as always goes to show that. As I found it also very funny back when I was in kit, uh, like, some people will, like, just go like, oh, uh, you're in the clan of, uh, like, the speedrunners and stuff. Oh, you must be a speedrun too. It's just, no. It's like, yeah, the, the speedrunners are in there. <laughs> there are a bunch of them... Uh, but uh it's an open clan oh well it's not an open clan but it's it's like you can get invited into it pretty easily uh, they just recruit openly <coughs> meaning that yeah anybody can be in it's kind of elephant as well i think like has the speed running component but also just recruits anybody basically Which you kind of need, of course, to like keep the life in the in the in the clan, because yeah, the speedrunners will most of the times be just off doing their own thing. And that doesn't really make a sociable clan. Great work. <laughs> now just seal that bunker and stop exposing your team to not so low doses of radiation. Incoming, high risk hostile. Radiation detected at acceptable level. Great work, Agent. The power plant is stable. Now get the hell out of there. Torres is waiting for your signal. Big chest. You're ready to come home. Then we still have to get out of here. It's gonna be north. Yeah, it's gonna be northern extraction. Oh no, it's gonna be western extraction. Ah. So things here and bunched up, so we can head in once. Oh, we'll be missing one. Um. System, 
Oh yeah, let's push in. That actually is, uh, yeah. <clears throat> Enemy active. I wonder what they think it's doing. Like, because yeah, they're, they're not like really low level. They are 1k. Also, uh, quite often, a lot of people think that uh, you need. Uh, You need to actually use the skill to... Where's this healing hive? Oh. That you need to use the skill for it to... Uh, to like get experience with, which you don't. It just gets experience with it, as long as it's equipped. One hunter in the back there, so I hear a chopper coming in as well, so I'm just going to murder that guy, double back. And yeah, this really will be my last one, let's see. I'm almost like... Slowly like just moving away and just... <laughs> Has it protected health? Yeah. Well, if nothing else, I've got a uh, ton of resources today. Gonna build back up as I was pretty low. And but yeah, no closers or setups in uh, significant ways. Oh yeah, a ton of uh, countdown uh, points as well. So if nothing else, I'll be getting a bunch of exotic components out of it. Be cutting it close. Seeing as I had this minigun, I might as well use a few of its rounds. And yeah, watch the timer as well. Because yeah, I should, I'm gonna run away. Right. Off we go. Because yeah, the danger with that always is uh, to wait a little bit too long, but everybody extracted there, which is good. Uh, yeah, and uh, both teams will have been one hunter short, which uh, is common when you spawn across from Jenna. Stack crew, fully min max for Gil. I mean, legendaries are more about... Because, yeah, just the builds don't make the difference there. Uh, more about knowing what to use when and stuff. That's kind of as well why I don't really um, run them that often. I feel they're not just the harder game, they're more of a challenge of just knowing where everything is and stuff. But yeah, with, with a lot of the groups that we've had, we definitely go and... Uh, deal with some legendaries because they're not hard they're very much not hard you just kind of need to know at points what to do like there's some trial and error basically tied to it of just like 
famously, for instance, in DUA, like that that setup of going up to the balcony in the mall area or something like that. That, that you just yeah find by its trial and error. Same for like the boss fight in District Union or um, in uh, Capital, where you like wait for the enemies to move across, so you move up behind them and go get set up in that one area and stuff like that. Like, it's much more about those kind of things. Uh, but yeah, that's very much going to be it for me. <laughs> that said, indeed, uh, I'm uh, I'm slowly falling asleep. Uh, and, uh, yeah, slowly want to be counting sheep and uh, going to actual sleep. Uh, but I'll be back at it tomorrow. Um, uh, although actually, yeah, tomorrow of course is uh, other games Thursdays, <laughs> which uh, I haven't actually picked what I'm going to be uh, playing anyway. So uh, uh, yeah, uh, I'll I'll find something uh, that shouldn't be too hard. <laughs> find something that. Uh, gonna chat about and stuff and uh we'll have some it's fun in theirs um and yeah i'll likely uh, be putting together a video tomorrow as well to either release tomorrow or maybe save for a uh, friday um and yeah likely as well uh, so i'll be missing saturday as well uh, uh just uh, yeah as i did say that before as well but just to repeat that and yeah, I'll be keeping the schedule, um, like the Twitch schedule, I'll be keeping that one up to date. So the, on that one, you can see when I'm going to miss a day or stuff, but I also always will say it uh, during the streams and stuff. Because yeah, I uh, do have a work engagement on Sunday as well. Likely I'll be starting a little bit late because I have a work engagement before the stream. And uh, the, the pen's kind of hard to pose if I'm late or not. Um... But yeah, I'll be back at it tomorrow, and uh, Friday um, we'll just have a back to normal uh, divisioning. As uh, as yeah, and uh, thanks everybody that uh, that uh, joined here, and uh, those as well that uh, watch the vods and uh, <laughs> get uh, all the way to these ends. And yeah, uh, I will. Uh, the only thing left is uh, for me uh, to wish you all to uh, to have a good night. 